Yeah, it's the 501, baby. Uh-huh. You know how we get down on the Whoopee podcast. Woo. Shout out OD, shout out G Holmes, it's the bad. Big sexy. Yo, welcome back to another episode of the Woo Pig Podcast, coming to you live from the Insurance Max Studios, where we talking, uh, we talking about everything Arkansas Razorback football and basketball every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday, even though it's Sunday. Y'all know what's going on. Y'all know what, y'all following us, man, but don't forget to check us out on the website at thewoopig.com. Hey, we want you to experience peace of mind with Insurance Max, your one-stop solution for home, auto, and commercial insurance statewide. Don't wait. Call today for a free no-obligation quote. Secure your future with Insurance Max, where protection meets affordability. Dial now. Safeguard what matters most. Holler at my guys, Wes, Caleb, and Sandy, 870-534-2823. And the Woo Pig Podcast, man, we streaming on all major platforms. Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Twitch, man, we even on Rumble. Make sure you subscribe to us on all platforms. And if you enjoy the audio-only version, you can catch us everywhere, Apple Podcasts, but we really rock with Spotify. You can switch between audio and video over there. And, man, we can't forget about our OG sponsor, 3M Electric. They're your trusted commercial and residential electrical contractor. As a SDVOSB, they're dependable and reliable with no job too big or small. When it comes to your electrical needs, contact 3M Electric, 479-408-9865. Let them know you heard, some, heard it on the Woo Pig podcast. They got something special for you. And, man, you already know who I got in the building. <laughs> Yo, what it do, Woo Pig family? It's your boy, G. Holmes, in the building, a.k.a. Big Sexy. Somebody I tell holla for me. Oh, oh, oh my God. Woo, yes, OD, sir. what it do, baby? Hey, man, it's, it's a Sunday. We out here on the doing the live stream, man. Hey, man, things you is know good. How. Things is good, but... Before we get into it, man, you know we we got to take the bad little brother everywhere we go, man. Oh, here he go. Ooh. <laughs> hey, hey Woo Pig family, y'all let me know if y'all like that animation with the Woo Pig <laughs> popping in there. Y'all like that? Anyway, DZ, what's up with you, baby? <laughs> <laughs> man, OD I'm something else. Intro. It make me feel like a superhero when I come in or something. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> man. Your voice super low, DZ. Turn yourself up. I can't hear you. You're a little low. But, uh... Man, what you get into this weekend, OD? Man, uh, you know, man, same old, same thing. Work <coughs> in the lab, trying to make the pie better. Hey, you know what it is, man. Yeah. Same old, same old, baby. Uh, Deezy, what you do, man? Man, it's been a it's been a week, but you know, I had work yesterday on Saturday, so you know, that's really my first off day. It's the beginning of my weekend. So I'm I'm All just right. thankful to be here with these people, man, and be in front of be on this show. This podcast man, is that's what's it's the up. highlight of my life. Man, <laughs> I, I spent the uh weekend up on the hill, man, with the fellas. Uh my brother in law Rodney, uh my uh sister in law Shannon <clears throat> and the son Jacob, a little nephew. Hey man, they I went to a uh we played golf on Friday and then we went to his uh he got a pretty good little team, man, little baseball team. The twelve year old um it's the twelve year old youth group called the Patriot Navy. Uh, they were in a tournament, man. They finished the weekend out three and one, uh, lost the game. But man, the dude is good, man. Uh, little nephew, I think he batting like five thirty something, like five thirty five, bro. It's I mean he got some ridiculous stats. So yeah, me and Chun went out there and uh, you know supported him. Also, uh, we will be on that uh, Friday next week. Ne- next Friday, we will uh, Friday night start at about six thirty. We are going to be at the walk-ons at uh, 1199 North Shallow Road. That's in Fayetteville, Arkansas. It's right there off of uh, 49, right there on Weddington. It's right over there. 
It's uh, walk-ons. We're going to be out on the back patio. So, uh, yeah, y'all come over there and kick it with the Woo Pig podcast. That's going to be next Friday. For, we're going to be in town for the spring game. <clears throat> and that's where we're going to be out kicking it that Friday night. So, man, come one, come all. Hey, I'm going to be there. The bad little brother going to be there. OD, uh, Coach Box is coming. I think, I don't know if Wes said he was coming up. Did he say he was coming up? I'm not sure uh, about that. I couldn't remember, but we might we got some people. I think 3M Electric is gonna come in. I got some uh Hall of Famers. Uh my brother B is he gonna be in the building, man. So y'all come on out, kick it with us, man. It's gonna be a big weekend in the hill because there's a lot of stuff going on. Uh people are trying to get excited about football, so we're gonna help them do it. Well, let's get it, man. Before we get into yes, anything, sir. man, I just wanna y'all see those names flashing across. I want to thank my members, man. Thank you guys. Uh, for supporting the Woo Pig podcast, man. Without you guys, man, none of this will be possible. So I wanted to make sure I give you guys a shout out before we get to cooking, man. So, man, it, it's been it's been a crazy week with so much news. Last time we came on here, we was talk. You guys heard, hey, Beard was gonna be the the next guy yeah. on the mm. list. He he's gonna be the next coach. But Beard came out and said, "Nah, player." I'm going to stay here at Ole Miss. Then we had Pootie Tang. Pootie Tang was going to be the coach. <laughs> and then Pootie Tang was like, nah, man, I'm going to be right here in Kansas State. Man, So, man, yeah. my question to y'all is, man, why, why did Eurocheck fail to seal the deal? The bad little brother, man. Let me see. Let me get the youth side of it, man. How you feeling about it? Okay, Razorback Nation. As y'all know, it's been a it's been a depressing week for us uh, on this basketball tip. But you know, I did a little homework just just listening to what the people are saying. Uh, certain people that I trust on why each one of these guys decided not to pick the Hogs. And you would think like, why not? We we much better than Ole Miss and K State. Like, why would they not come? So let's start with our old guy Beard. So word on the street is Beard hit us with a Gus Malzahn. He acted interested in the job just to get that raise, just to hurry up and get that extension signed. So I think he just hit us with a Gus Malzahn, like, hey, you see they want me over there in Arkansas. Y'all better pay up. And they did. So I heard that's why Beard stay. I don't, I don't know if there's any truth to that. Y'all let me know what y'all heard. And then with Tang, it was something weird. Um, um, I heard that he basically has some type of family situation going on to where he just couldn't leave, I'm guessing, or – or something weird. It had something to do with his family, though, and people didn't want to ask too many questions because, you know, they get a little personal with coaches. So that's what I'm hearing on my side, you know, just from the internet searching side of it. Yeah, man. For me, I I think we may have lost it. Um, a, a beard? I don't know. I, I Like you said, I think about him uh, flirting just to try to get that, get that, <clears throat> uh, secure his, you know, his next contract. I do, but... I'm also getting some uh, some news about that deal that he made is not really necessarily true at the moment. So he's I mean, and we were we were all together on uh, Saturday night, and I was sitting at some table with some folks, and I can tell you that what's happening is they're still talking. I mean, the decision apparently the decision is already was already made because I'm sitting at the table and one of the gentlemen get a text message that they're talking to another coach. And I will get into that, uh, you know, in a little bit. I know you got a, a segment on it. So for me, I don't know necessarily if the if it's over. I'm not going to actually uh, just pull Beard's name, you know, out of the hat altogether. You feel me? So, you know, for me, and then Tang, I don't know. Like, you know, Deezy said about his situation. Yeah, that could be true, but the lights are bright here. And, you know, a lot of times – you know, as fans, we always think that people want to run toward the brightest light, but sometimes that's a flame, and you know it could torch your career if this guy comes and it, you know comes here and he ain't quite ready for for this type of a challenge. Now, it it, it could be career ending for him. Maybe he want to get a couple of you know good runs at his his current you know position, and then he'll put himself in a better position. But I think the lights may have been too bright for that young man. So that's how I feel about those two. Out of out of them two guys, which one would you have wanted? A beard, no question asked. Yeah, yeah. No, I mean, hands down, beard, hands down. I mean, not not that's not even even close. 
So do do you guys think that it was a matter of money because of the beer didn't come, or what? What what was it that you, <clears throat> that how did your check fail to seal the deal? I mean, we we was talking about this. This was a done deal. Yes. Okay. So dig this. Okay. So it's not about the money. It's I don't this. It, okay. So in some conversations over the weekend. It's not this this right here, this coaching hire right here is not about money because some of those donors wanted him gone. Okay. So we the, the dynamic of the donations of the of the basketball team have drastically changed because he's gone. So what I'm hearing is money ain't gonna be the problem by getting no coach. That's not gonna be the issue. It ain't gonna be, oh dang, we can't pay him. It's gonna be, it's gotta be the right higher you know because i mean it's just got to be this right here is probably more pressure than hunter your has been on in a long time and this ain't even the big money you know sport but if he misses here what is he going to follow it up i mean you know he got muscle in here muscleman in here okay cool he gave you four or five years how do you follow that higher up to make sure that you are the legitimate ad and you can make those type of ad decisions so i think it's more crucial for for hunter but also for the university at this point. Mm. Well, well, hey, I guess we we'll see what what Hunter <clears throat> your check pulls out his hat, man. What you? Well, uh, I mean, what say you? You ain't answer the question. I don't know. How if you he, gonna pop, I don't know if he actually drops it. it. I don't know if he dropped the <clears throat> fail to seal the deal. To be honest with you, until it's that's all what I'm said saying. and done, we don't know if he actually dropped the ball yet. We speculating. Exactly. Is that's what I'm saying? So nobody knows if Hunter Year Check has dropped the ball. But we gonna cook on the rest of the show. So hopefully you're you're you know, Hunter watched this show, he gonna understand what we really want as fans. Cause I think that, you know, the Woo Pick podcast, we speak uh, as fans. Facts. So we really oh, yeah. gonna we really talking about what we really like and what we really want. So uh before we go to the next segment though. I gotta uh I gotta shout out my super chats. Been working on some things, man. We thank you for supporting the channel, man. Yes, sir. 501, 501 Ice Man. Wipe we your appreciate feet. we appreciate you. He said, Woo Pig, I wipe my feet properly, man. That's what we're talking about. We appreciate <laughs> you, baby. Man, appreciate you. And we got thank Braylon Carter hit us with a super chat, man. Thank you for supporting the channel, man. We appreciate you 100 percent Now, moving on to the next. Segment. Ooh, the animation is dope, man. I'm yeah, that's dope, man. Who is this guy, man? This, this dude is a mad scientist. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> Did we interview Cal? That's word on the street that we interviewed yo, Cal. Yo. But how would you guys feel if we hired Thanos? Co- Coach Cal <laughs> like Thanos out here, bro. Do we really why want you say Thanos? That, bro? Why you say that, man? Why? Why you think he's the destroyer? Bro, he destroyed. <laughs> it, I mean, every dude. G, you, hey man, we brothers for real because we didn't even talk about this, and you already picking up what I'm putting down. Everywhere bro. he's gone and left, Miss. Uh, okay, are you mass right? Everywhere he's gone and left, Memphis. Everywhere he's gone and left. Okay, so now he at Kentucky. So now what's happening? Hey, I don't know what's happening, but I do know what happened when he leave. Ain't nobody left. Ain't nobody Not left. Ain't nothing, but some, ain't nothing but some dust. Put, hey, what you say? Two pumps in a cloud of dust. Two pumps in a cloud of dust, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Touch and Bust. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. But we going to cook on the rest of the show. But back to the question. How y'all feel if the Hogs pulled John Calipari from Kentucky and made him the Hogs coach? Daisy? I don't want to say it too loud because I don't want I don't want to get burned at the stake. But I, I would take it, please. I, I'll take I'll take it. I mean, coming off of what we coming off of, like you got to think, man. I know we're gonna get it a look get into it a little bit later in the show, but we got one player left on scholarship. We Bang need a one. superstar hire. We need yeah. somebody who can literally <clears throat> like Thanos turn nothing into something. Like even if he <clears throat> turn that something back into nothing, whenever he done. I will take it. I'm sorry. That's like asking, would you take Saban if he came out of retirement? Yes. Come back. Yes. <laughs> let's do it. I'm. I'm yo, I feel like, what do we got to lose? That's where I'm at. 
G, what about you, man? What, what if we hired Thanos, man? Yo, so my thing is this. All right, yeah, that would be great. But what, what are the, uh, you know, what are the true logistics to that hire? So no one's talking about they already, he was one game away, one win away from them actually owing him $33 uh, million on his buyout. Because he's got a contract that's good to through 20, the 28-29 uh, season, right? So because he didn't make that win, that did knock his buyout down to $27 million. <clears throat> So who willing to pay him $27 million to leave? We ain't. Mm. We ain't. You know, you feel, <clears throat> that's what we I'm saying. We're so, on the budget at Arkansas. I don't know what you're talking about. We're on the budget out here. That's what I'm saying. So are, are, y'all, are they really looking at the logistics of it? You know, and that's just, and that's the 75% of that remaining of his contract. So... Yeah, it would be a great hire, but are you going to bankrupt them? You know, are you going to bankrupt the bank trying to do it? Dang. Or can you throw this other money in and try to get the uh, and try to get your guy Chris Beard if he's still on the table? Because ain't nothing that came out in Ole Miss saying that they signed him. Ain't not, ain't, that ain't hit yet. Yeah. So what does that mean? Because don't you think that Ole Miss wants to solidify their head coach as soon as possible, too? This ain't no just one way run right now. So they ain't posted nothing up about him signing because they would have done it tomorrow morning. Going to go, I mean, they they gonna snatch the panty down on something tomorrow. <laughs> I'm just saying, yeah. somebody get snatched tomorrow. Hey, well, I'm I'm gonna keep it a I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. I do not like John Calipari, no shape, form, or fashion. <clears throat> I would not be happy if he was the coach. I don't care how much he won. I just don't, bro. You don't like John, him, why though, bro? Tell I, me why. You know tell how me why? Like Cause he be winning. No, no, no I'm gonna no, tell no, you no. why. No, yeah. this is what I'm gonna do. Go, go ahead, do Hold up. Go ahead. Go this ahead. is what. This is why I say. This is why I come. I know you because y'all. Y'all already seen how Od was about the tournament, right? Hogs didn't make the tournament. This dude didn't watch no games, man. None. Ah, mm. oh, man. Hogs ain't in it, so I don't care. I don't care. Oh, you see what I'm saying? That's what he did. He don't he don't like nothing like that. So guess you just what? Hate because I'm a razor back. See what I'm saying? <laughs> he already know where I'm going. He already know he already know where I'm going because all of, I mean Calipari over the over his tenure, especially when he was in, in as he was at Kentucky, because we we saw them the most. He had consistently built teams that were beating the Razorbacks, and because of that. OD don't like the man that was associated with it because he saw, hey, man, he was paying the players. He was doing this. He was cheat. He was doing all this. No, he was making, he was building a better program. However, he was doing it. If he left a duffel bag in the, you know, in the trunk, whatever he had the to do. duffel bag, boys. So that's what I'm saying. So if he was doing that, bet he ain't get caught. Uh-oh, that's he didn't. legal. Oh, I'm glad you said that he didn't get caught. Okay, moving on. Let me uh. uh see. <laughs> <laughs> see, I'm, I'm glad, I'm glad I, you said I know him. See, he tried to chase us up. when I'm cooking on him, that's why he don't like it because <laughs> Kyler Perry was building a team that was consistently better than the Razorbacks, and he mad about it. Tell the mad. truth, man. I ain't mad, but I'm gonna read my super chat before we move on to the next segment. Segment. Uh, <laughs> hey, Kenny Long, man, we appreciate you supporting the channel, man. 100. He says, pair character stretching his arms forward, raising his thumb up. Pearl, hold up! What a pair of characters stretching his arm for them. We appreciate the super chat, man. Thank you for supporting. Yeah, I appreciate the you, bro. We don't know what that one was about. Yeah. but we gonna ride Brent, with you, man. Yeah. Thank you for supporting the channel, man. He said, mm-hmm. "I don't believe it's solely an athletic director issue. It's possible that our perceived appeal isn't as high as we anticipated." What? But, okay. Hey, hit the horn for him. Hit the horn for him, G. Hey. hey. <laughs> Well, they halfway shooting shots at the university as a program. I know. We're going to cook yeah, on I that, mean, too. I mean, you know what I mean? I mean, I'm not going to just disguise like I understand what they were saying. That They're saying, you know, maybe Hunter is a great executive. Yeah. Maybe they don't want to just come to Arkansas. Mm-hmm. Hey, Zach Fletcher, thank you for supporting the channel, man. He says, Cal better be bringing his luggage. Hey, man, Thank we you. don't want that 40-year-old Louie he got. <laughs> we don't want the 40-year-old Louie, Louis, man. He can keep that. He can keep hey, it. Hey, man, I don't know about all that. I'm going to say this. I'd rather get us a coach that's been beating us down than a coach that we've been winning over. Oh, uh, bro. You feel me? Oh, it's, so, oh, it's, so let me I'm ask you a question, you. Deezy. 
Let me ask you a question, DZ. Let's say you hired a little shorty, right? Shorty, man, exactly. shorty, she got it going on, bro. You trying to holler at her. But she, but she, hey, she like, nah, DZ. I got, I got the dope boy over here. She get with the dope boy. She got three kids by the dope boy. Now, now she big and she wide as all outside. Look like Mm-mm. a can of busted biscuits. Then she coming back no four or five years later saying, hey, DZ, hey, big head. She sliding in your hey. DMs. <laughs> hey, big head. What hey, you gonna do? Head. You go, you go, you go take her back? You gonna be like, come nah. on, girl, I wanted you all my life. Hey, nah, if I'm I got three that. kids too, we might be able to make it work. Oh man, <laughs> hey, if I had my <laughs> son guns, I, I, I shoot, I shoot him at you, DZ. <laughs> I would shoot him at you. And hey, we'll be cheaper hey, by the dozen if she still got that face card. <laughs> hey, say she still on the uh got them uh, that EBT. <laughs> yes, sir. Man, I can't she gonna be good by eight hundred dollars worth. I can't believe y'all mm. said this, man. Moving on, man. <laughs> Hi, Will Wade, man. Why is this not a slam dunk decision, man? I want to know. Who say? Okay, first off, I mean it depends on who say that. Who who say that? Are we listening to the people that's all on here talking about? Oh no, he's dishonest. He he was paying his players at LSU. One one one. Are we answering them folks? Or are we answering like real folks? Cause that's two different. That's two separate answers. I'm gonna you speak to who you want to speak to. I'm gonna speak okay. to who I want to speak to. Well, I I feel like this. Okay, I, I I'm good with Will Wade. Because, I mean, ain't nothing brand new happening under the sun. Just j- different people do it, right? So, you know what he was? I mean, he was so passionate. I say he was passionate about the program, about getting that program together. And, and he was presented with an opportunity to make them better. He was like, you know what? Oh, shoot. You know, a little 1500 here and there, that ain't even that, that much money. It ain't. And, of course, we heard the story about how he really tried to help people, uh, JP talked about. So, you know what? If you had the means to be able to do that, to help people, you know, would you bend the rules? Absolutely you would. So I ain't going to just, you know, what? Well, guess what? He, he got in trouble. Whatever his punishment was, some people feel like, oh, is his he got off easy. Everybody else that was dealing with it went to jail. Well, hey, sound like he had the best lawyer. <laughs> That's all I'm telling you. <laughs> that that sounds like to me. That doesn't sound like any type of discrimination. Hey, man, he could afford a better lawyer than you. You lost. You got to do a little time. Don't hold that against the man. You know what? They shot, they shot at him, and this is the punishment that he got. Now, how is he on the basketball court since that's that's over with? So that's what I'm at with it. Man, the dude is a pretty decent coach. I liked when he was at LSU. I liked the way that they were playing tough. I liked the toughness of the team. They really did, you know, they played together. I know a lot of that sometimes has to be with the people that you choose, the players and stuff, but a lot of times uh, uh, basketball teams, any type of your team, they take the – the personality of the coach. So if you got a coach that's that's a, a fighter, if you got a coach that's that's willing to to stick his neck out there for you, you know, you play better for him. So I think he's a great hire for uh for me. And I I'm gonna piggyback off that. I completely agree. And for those who don't know, Will Wade Will Wade received a 10 game suspension and a two year show cause until 2025 for his involvement in the program's re- recruiting scandal or whatever. So I think that's what's making Hunter Yurchek a little bit hesitant about hiring him. Uh, he's afraid that because of those sanctions that recruits probably won't want to come. I disagree. Hunter Yurchek, if you're watching this, I disagree. Will Wade got the energy. Will Wade hungry. Anybody that hired Bobby Petrino and then is looking the other way at Will Wade is a hypocrite. I'm sorry. That's facts. So, facts. These, nah, yeah. I'm, I'm team hey, Will these, Wade. I think you've been on my computer, bro. I, I think you've you been on my alike, computer, bro. man. We didn't even talk about this, Wu Pig family. Hey, man. Bro, that's how we, we think, though. That's why we brothers. The baddest one. <laughs> now. It's time for an OD rant. I'm about to cook. Everybody who's sitting there talking about Will Wade's a cheater. Will, Will Wade's a cheater. Your favorite coach is a cheater. All these dudes you see right here, John Calipari, he paid Marcus, he paid Marcus Canby. Derrick Rose was academically ineligible to play the entire year. The boy didn't even go to class. Mm. Mm. Kelvin Sampson. Left Oklahoma, dusted and disgusting. Mm. 
Woo! Oh, D shooting at him. <laughs> Bruce Pearl left Tennessee, <laughs> dusted and disgusted. Mm. Bobby Petrino didn't actually technically pay a player, but he had some stuff. Y'all know what he did. We ain't even gonna talk yeah. about it. <laughs> Your favorite well. coach is a cheater, but you want a whole Will Wade to the fire. Man. Will you want a whole Will Wade. Wade to the fire because he doing what everybody know what has been done. The Will Wade was just stupid. Bottom yeah. line, you, ain't, you shouldn't call directly to the guy that you're paying and say, hey, what you want? How much you want? Yeah. Hey, Bruh, I'm gonna call OD. I'm gonna call DZ. I'm gonna call G. I'm gonna call G Holmes. Hey man, I need you to call this boy and see what he man. want. I got the money. I got the duffel yeah, bag boy that's ready to drop it off. Yeah. But nah. Yeah, he's he trying to have a relationship. This ain't about yeah. the relationship. But all <laughs> these do your favorite coach is a cheater. Stop trying to judge Will Wade talking about uh, his character. All these dudes got flawed character. Every last yeah. one of them. You act like you ain't never did nothing wrong that you ain't got caught for. <laughs> Everybody a felon. I mean, All everybody's us. a felon. You, you a felon. You done done some felonious behavior. You know what I mean? You just didn't get caught. You got away with yours. Bill Be <laughs> like, just like Wes said in the comments, Bill Belichick, he's a cheater. The That's dude right. who won a national Whoa. championship in football this year. Cheater. Come on, bro. Whoa. They all cheat. They all, they all cheat. cheat. Stop yeah, that's it. Bad. That's, that's why, you know, I would say, man, it it wouldn't be any worse if, if Will Wade was a black dude. If he was a black dude, I, I would have said, yeah. man, they doing it because he's black. No, this for real. They just holding that against him. And You know <laughs> what I mean? You know they, they meant that if they do a white boy like that. <laughs> you brought, if, if you was the coach, you wouldn't. Even, we wouldn't even be talking about him because you wouldn't have that job down there. Yeah. Where so the bottom line, you honey, you're I mean, yeah. Hey, man, we want the best dude in the building. We want the best. We want one. the best dude in the building. And if you can't get Pootie Tang and you can't get Chris Beard, go get. Don't he, he, be bringing. Pickings. Yes. Don't be bringing no scrubs in here. And before I get to these scrubs that you talking about bringing in here. I'm going to read my Super Chats first. Let me get over there to the Super Chats. Uh, let's see where I left off. I think it was this one. Braylon Carter, man, we appreciate you, man, supporting the channel, man. He's less. Let's get Don Staley at this point. Hey, I ain't <laughs> mad at it. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't even mad at you, dog. Yeah, she probably the only one that could coach a, 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 man, a man's basketball team. I'm telling you, they gotta respect her. Hey, man, shout out Thank to God. Rick Go Hog Spears, man. He shout, he sent us a super chat. Thank you for supporting the channel. Hey, man, we got a we got the Louisville guy back in the building, man. Stay right here. Yes, sir, Louisville. He said, as a Louisville fan, it's wild seeing Hall fans freak out about what Wade did. Our man, school that's... had them ladies up in there. Will Wade was paying guys just like everyone else. That's... Do y'all want to win or not? Man, <laughs> man bro, that's a fact. Win. I want to Everybody, I want to win. Big facts. Big facts, you little guy. He know the bro. business. He know the business, man. That's what I'm saying. Why y'all doing him like that? Man, come on back down here, bro. Hey, hey, what they them... say, if you ain't cheating, you ain't trying. You ain't trying. You ain't... They all <laughs> cheat. <laughs> they all love Every last <laughs> one of them cheat, man. So we ain't tripping about you, man. Go ahead and do your thing. But one thing we don't want, honey, you're a check. This is, is this is what we don't want. The bomb squad. <laughs> the bomb squad. <laughs> we don't want none of these dudes. None of we them. Don't want, we don't want uh, Daryl Walker or we Chris want... Sainz. Nope. They the bomb no. squad. No, nope, we don't want any one of them. Please. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Bro, you Daryl Walker like what? Mm-mm. How old is Daryl Walker? I gotta see this, cause man, no, Daryl Walker. They and you know they said they was talking to him too. I'm like, why? Mm -mm. Why? That mm -mm. dude had a man. he had a decent year at, at Euler, but but lost in the tournament. And no, no nah, dog, no nah, dog. Mm -mm. You ain't 63 ready. Three years old, man. No, nah, nah. he ain't ready. Y'all hey, want y'all want Joe Biden as the coach? Is that what y'all want? <laughs> <laughs> hey G, hit that super that trash, man. Ooh. Super <laughs> trash. I do <told>, right. <laughs> we do not want either one of these dudes. If no, you no. bring Chris Sainz here, Hunter Yurichek, you're fired. 
You big cold-blooded dummy. They going to fire you, bro. They going to light you up on the... Boy, they going to put you out of here on the first thing smoking if you bring that boy here. <laughs> yeah, they will. <laughs> yeah. That would be probably what his last action in is acting AD. <laughs> Man. Hey, they going to run you up out of here, bro. There ain't going to be no NIL, NIL money. You going to be operating on a $20,000 budget. Yeah. Man. All and your donors shut down. <laughs> Man, I, I just don't get it. Like, what what do y'all want, people? Like, I want to win. Mm -hmm. That's man. funny, man. Will Wade and <laughs> win 30, 30 and four. I understand it was at a at an old school down in Louisiana, but still, the dude has won everywhere he's gone, man. He down mm -hmm. in LSU at a football school winning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm just saying, man. Crazy. I'm just saying, bro. So that that's man. I'm just let's let's move on. Do not bring these dudes in from the bomb squad. We don't <laughs> want these dudes from the bomb squad. <laughs> bomb squad. <laughs> and if y'all don't know that dude that's yelling bomb squad, man, y'all gotta y'all gotta stop. Y'all gotta watch some other sports, man. Before I go into my getting into the next. Segment, man. Uh, I gotta get my super chats, man. Five hundred one. I eat the cake, ain't it, man? Reports coming anime. in on Twitter right now that Calipari, the guy, his buyout is thirty three million if they fire him. Oh, for him to leave for a different school, a different job, mm. bro. They better not pay no thirty three million buyout for Coach Calipari, bro. Bro, that's what I told you. It's twenty seven million. Because he, he he lost that last that last game. Man, they better not pay no two man, bruh. Man, I ain't feeling this, dog. Hey. hey man, thank you for supporting the channel, man. We appreciate you, man. Bruh, come on, man. They cannot be seriously thinking about paying Mo. that much money for John Calipari, bro. I was on zero then. Bro, I'm I'm looking at it, man. You see you you checked it out? No, I don't want to check it out. Bro, go ahead and check it out, man. This coming, this hot off the press right here, bro. Bro, they better not hey, have no think John about Calipari. this, bro. Though. Think about this. We got what? over 600 people in here right now, and we do Yo. not got enough likes to show that. That's what I need y'all to think about. Everybody, hey. exit out of the chat right now. Go smash that like button. Super smash it two times it. if it'll man. let you. Man, y'all get down on the like button, man. I'm to I'm telling y'all, man, that might be some, it might be some, some, uh, some burn on that, man. It's crazy. We can't yeah, afford it. That's crazy. But somebody I can, I bro. This, somebody bro. can. Somebody was, can afford it, bro. Who was West that's Moore? What I who was West Moore? I that's the uh the the news guy down here. West Moore, you somebody on channel on channel eleven? I don't trust him. But here go the deal. But I, was, <laughs> I don't I don't trust it, man. Until they came out with a press conference, I don't trust them, bro. Man. Hey, bro, but listen to me. If you had John Calipari, you'd be mad? I mean, I ain't going to be mad. You. But I, this, I, I ain't going to be mad, but, bro. Bro, it's the, I told you. I, I was told that this this hire ain't going to have nothing to do with money. Ain't going to have nothing to do with money. Remember that. It ain't have nothing to do with money. So they're going to pay the money because they wanted they, them gone. They wouldn't pay $16 million to get rid of You don't Pittman. know. You wouldn't, you wouldn't pay $16 I didn't say, million. I said dollars. they wouldn't. They didn't get no, rid of them. No, I'm, no, I'm telling you, you you wouldn't. Somebody will. Shoot. They didn't much really want to get rid of Sam Pittman bad enough then, but you're going to pay $33 what, million to get ex John Exactly. Cal exactly you what I John just said. Watch John Exactly. That, exactly. Because somebody didn't feel that strongly about it. But right. I promise you. I'm just telling you, bro. It's people that got money like that. It's got people that got money like that. I ain't. I ain't. I would love to see it. I ain't feeling. That's it. what I'm saying. I am not feeling it. I promise you, I'm not feeling it. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it, bro. Hey, y'all don't messed up his whole little mood, Wes. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it, man. Let me get back. Let me get back to the show, man. We got a couple look more at, look topics. At it, man. <laughs> yeah, a couple more Beasy. topics, man. Look at it. You see, I, I'm telling y'all, this dude right here, uh, uh, man. Oh, did you talk? We didn't talk about. Uh, oh, hey, oh there you go. Jalen Shelley, man. He dis, he decommits from the Hogs, man. 
Yeah. Four stars, six, eight hundred and ninety pounds out of Branson, Link Academy. I think he originally from Texas. He gone. Mm. Hey, we we hey, see I that the players commit. They commit to the coach, not the school. Yep. So we lost him. Any any thoughts on this dude? Nah. Uh, I hate it. We we needed it. Uh, in a day where the transfer portal is going crazy, you need to lock in as many of those big star high school freaks that you can get. So, yeah, I hate it. I mean, we should have seen it coming, but. Yeah. I mean, everybody can can decommit now, though. So they may recommit, I mean, depending on who the coach is. So that's why I'm saying a decision got to be made by tomorrow. If if you don't have a decision made by tomorrow, use Hunter Yurchek loses as an executive. That's that's what I'm saying. He he loses as an executive because now you people are looking back at this little video that you put out, and they was like, "Oh, you was being messy, and you ain't even had your ducks in a row." You stupid. Boy. You stupid, man. You you can't be shooting shots like that to that kid, man, and and you yeah. ain't even got nobody to to, to replace him. Hmm. Man, I got a, I got a couple more uh, super chats. Mama Armstrong to hit us with a super Mama chat. Mama Armstrong. She yes, said, y'all hit 3,000 subscribers. Man, that's what I'm talking about, man. Yes, sir. Good. Thank you. Come on to us, Man, yes, sir. We appreciate everybody, man. Hey, like I said, man, this weekend we're going to be in Fayetteville at the um, at Walk-Ons. We're going to be at Walk-Ons, meet and greet, man. We're going to be hanging out, just chilling out on the patio, uh, starting at six thirty. That is the walk-ons. That is in uh, uh, right there off of Weddington, one, one nine eleven ninety nine North Shiloh Drive, right there off of Weddington. It's from six thirty until they get up, until they make us leave. So everybody, y'all come out, kick it with us. Mm. Man, we got another super chat. Hog John, John Tyson, and Coach Cal. Our close friends, money not an issue if we're if we're talking to them. That's, that's what I'm telling. Yeah, that's what I can. That's what I tell. I I was told to. I mean, this weekend, it this hire ain't gonna be about the money. Hmm. Ah, but we got another super chat, man. Rick Go Hog Spirit says, "Come on, OD. Of course, we hire Kyle and roll with the talent he brings in. Get Will Wade, he will crush it." However, it's going to be Chris Jans. Man, shoot the shot at, the, at Rick, God. man. Ooh. Oh, my God. Ooh, Chris Jans. You started what? off so hot. He did. But you know what? That's like Arkansas half. to get y'all hyped up about, oh, we getting Cal, we getting Cal. And then next thing you know, Chris uh, Jans, the new coach at the University of Arkansas. Boy, yeah. I'm telling you, if they hire Chris Jans, it's going to be some smoke in – the sit in the state. Man, it's gonna be some it, smoke. We gonna get we gonna cook him from now until we're gonna be cooking him. Are you serious, bro? Bro. Gosh. Hey man, the battle missed the mark. <laughs> we lost two guys, baby. Yeah. We we, we talking got one. about 30 points right there. Yeah. I mean. That's I think that's the worst news of the week so far, personally. Like outside of lo- missing on beard, or it allegedly missing on beard, losing battle and mark. Battle and mark is the only hope we had left. I I'm I'm distraught mm. to say the least. Well. Mm. Well, I mean, but uh, okay, guess what? So whatever coach comes in here is gonna have a clean slate, clearly. The only person left on scholarship right now is Brazil. Yep. That's it, man. And Brazil. And one transfer coming in. And do you, who are you talking about? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, talking yeah. about the other guy. Uh, he probably so going to get you, out of there, too. Yeah. Do y- y'all think Brazil will declare for the draft? Yep. I think he got That's it what at I'm this thinking. Point. That's what I'm thinking. I don't, I don't think he gets in a portal. I think, I think he declares himself for the draft. Mm. Imagine Brazil at A State. <laughs> yeah, I think he declares for the draft myself. I mean, just imagine being a coach coming in to nothing. Like, has that ever happened? Like, I know nobody. Like nobody. You, I mean, but mm-hmm. I mean, that's is that a blessing or is that a curse? I mean, you, you got a, I mean, you got a blank slate. 
So everything you build, I mean, but you do lose yourself about a year of excuses about these are I'm playing with the players that was here. You know, I'm playing with this. That's that's over with. That that excuse is over with. So whoever comes in here is gonna be truly something that they build from their scheme and their everything. So I don't know. I don't think it's a big deal. I don't think it's a big mm-hmm. deal that there's no players left because in yeah. the day of NIL and the way it's set up, man, these coaches going to get the players that they want. And I don't think it'll be a big deal. I honestly <clears> don't. <throat> I think those guys will build a, their roster fairly quickly and move on. But we got to get the right guy. We can't go get no Chris Sands, bro. I'm sorry. We can't no, no, no. hire that dude. Or, nah. I mean, I know Darrell Walker probably deserve a shot at a better job. But, man, we, we don't we don't need no experiment, man. Don't be trying to hire dudes for you know two point eight million dollars and think that they're gonna give you, you know, eight point five million dollar results. You get what you pay for. Mm, you get what you pay for. Yeah. So hey, so that's that's it, man, on uh on all the topics, man, uh that we didn't that we didn't ran through. Uh man, before we jump into the next segment, man, uh we're gonna get DZ. How about our sponsors, man? Yes, sir. All right, y'all know what it is, man. Experience peace of mind with Insurance Max, your one-stop solution for home, auto, and commercial insurance nationwide. Don't wait. Call today for a free no-obligation quote and secure your future with Insurance Max, where protection meets affordability. Get those guys a call at 870-534-2823. And then we got to give love to 3M Electric, serving Northwest Arkansas. They're your trusted commercial and residential electric contractor. As an SDV, OSB, they're dependable and reliable with not a single job on this earth too big or too small. So hit up 3M Electric for all your electrical needs. Get them a call at 479-408-9865. And let them know that you heard it on the Pig Pod, and they might do something special for you. You know, No promises, but shout out those guys. Those some good people for real. Man, we appreciate you, DZ. But man, um, it's a, it's a lot going on, man. Let me. Um, I'm gonna throw this up in the chat. Y'all know how we get down. We are gonna open it up uh, to the hog pen. Let me copy that. And then, man, anybody who want to come up and kick it with us, man, you definitely can. You know how Box we do on the on, pig. Box said he was on his way back to the house. All right. Uh, I think I got a couple more super chats here to read here in just a second. <clears throat> yeah, come up and argue, man. I got some questions for y'all tonight. But yo, uh, DZ, why, why, uh, OD doing that? So I, I you know, I like Calipari Perry though, because you know, I, I looked at some of his 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 records, like at UMass, he was or at Massachusetts, he was one ninety three and seventy one at his tenure there at Memphis, his two fifty two and sixty nine, and at Kentucky. He's 14 and 123. He done been, he's won 18 conference titles, uh, won the SEC tournament, you know, 15 times. The dude got a championship. I mean, bro, it, six it final get, fours. It don't get better than that. Like, who, who I mean, are we going to find better than that? Yeah. I mean, you talking about a dude that's got a 76 percent uh, win ratio over his tenure. Over 32 years. Come on, man. If he say, you know, I want somebody to uh, suck the chocolate off my peanuts and, and put them in a bowl, it, it might be worth that. I'm just saying. Hey, and if people keep thinking <laughs> this, I keep hearing that, you know, Calipari washed up or he on the decline. I just seen somebody comment that. I will take uh, Calipari on the decline over uh, Chris Jans on the on, at his peak on, on any the day. Up. <laughs> Like, come on. Y'all crazy? I will take it. I ain't with it. I ain't with it. We used to be the retirement state. Come on and retire here. I got to get back on these super chats, man. Here was the last one. Hey, man. Shout out to A-Rob, man, for uh, super chatting. We appreciate you. Thanks for supporting the channel with the super sticker. Uh, Zach Fletcher. So is the beard. Thank you for supporting the channel, man. 
He says, so is the beard talk reopening or nah? Um, Let's answer yeah, that question. I don't think it's ever closed. I don't think it was ever over. I mean, you know what I'm saying? What you mean? Me? I mean, he he like they, he tweeted that he was he old miss. Did he not tweet that? Is your word no longer bond? Wait a minute. I never saw that. You didn't you, see this his tweet? See, I don't, I don't think I saw that. Did you yeah. see it? I've been hearing about it. It, I, I, it was his Twitter account. I mean, his Twitter account had a, yeah. had a video on there. He ate, okay, uh, so guess fact, what? what he say? But guess what? what Musselman said too the uh, the day before he got on that plane and went to California. That man, he's he's feeling more motivated than ever right now. So, really? that, but that ain't no false statement. It's not a false statement that I'm hearing. Mo, oh, Miss, I, when he did it, he he is. Mm, nah, I'm just saying, man. We'll see. Tomorrow shall be a great day. So my next question, man, while we waiting on somebody to come in and kick it with us, um, if Arkansas is a top fifteen program like they say it is, mm -hmm. why 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 is it so difficult for us to lock down the coach? In my opinion, I think it's because we so wobbly at that fifteen position. Some years we up to number 10. Some years we down to 22, 23. It's, it's a weird job. I mean, because on one end, you got to think, we don't have any professional sports, any major professional sports, let me say that. So you can be worshipped here or you can be <laughs> burned at the stake. So you got to be really built for these type of fans that we have. Like we are truly a diehard state. We gonna live and die with the hogs. And if you dead, we gonna make sure you dead. Like, look at Chad. <laughs> they Morris. gonna run over you. <laughs> Chad Morris can never get a job anywhere important again, and that's just how it is. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. So, so I, I mean, I don't, I don't know, bro. Mm mm mm. mm. Yeah, Chris Beard. We, hot, he weird. says, "Hotty toddy, great times ahead in Oxford. We are just getting started. Win the shit, win the sip." Okay, mm -hmm. so that says what? After that, he posts a video of what? Uh, I mean, you gotta go look at it. I ain't finna post it here. So, but I that, mean, but but, but I'm, what I'm saying it. is, is it any kind of uh, picture of him signing his new deal? Hey, man. No, but do you see any college exactly. coaches sign a new deal? Huh? What you, you mean? You see any any college coaches sign new deals? But what you know what I mean? Oh, because guess what, what I, bro? To me, that's not an admission of saying. I'm sorry that you feel that way. I got a super chat, man. Old Smiles Outdoors says John Calipari has interest in Arkansas. Went from a good coach to a great coach. It's on X and everywhere. NILs talking about it. Yeah, it's a conversation. And and the funny thing is, is uh before it became a conversation, people was talking about it. You know, the people in these, you know, different rooms, you know, at the at the barbershop, they was talking about this and I didn't believe it. So uh my man, uh, if I know you watching this, man, my bad. I didn't I I didn't I, I neglected to think that that was, you know, the case too. So it um man, you don't know, O D. So it's the money about to transpire. It's about to change hands. You can believe that. Man. We just hope it's the right, the right one. If if they pay 30, 27, 33 million, whatever it takes to get Coach Cal out his deal, they bet not holler Arkansas ain't got no money to pay these football players. They bet not ever let it slip out their mouth that they got a sorry team because we as regular people not giving to the NIL. Bro, you can keep you can. You can straight, bruh, I want to say it so bad. You can straight, <laughs> yeah, don't ever form your mouth to say we went, we losing because we ain't got no NIL and the people ain't contributing. Bro, they better not pay that fool $33 million, 27 whatever million dollars to get million. out of his deal to be the coach. That's crazy. They better not say if they That's all I got to say. If they pay that, that means they are showing us that we are officially – Settling to be a basketball school because if they didn't pay that for Pittman and they had paid, come on now, it's crazy. Mm -hmm.
Hold like on. I said, that means the right person didn't want him gone, DZ. If the right person wants you gone, that's got that kind of money, but, you know, they selective with it. I mean, that's the problem that you're dealing with. That's what I'm saying. The right person didn't want Pittman gone. But the right person wanted Bobby Petrino back, though. Right? Mm. Yeah, that's real. What Uh-oh. up, Mello? What What's going man? on, man? Where your boy at? Who did? I don't know. I, he said he was on his way home, Box. Nah, JP, I'm not looking for Box no more. I'm on JP. <laughs> <laughs> y'all let JP. Y'all let JP come up here and feed y'all all their false information and sit there like he was telling the truth. Come on, man. I did my research. Uh oh, look at it. See, they don't want nobody to cook. <laughs> yeah, you better, you better get you back on some Wi Fi, Mello. Yeah. So um, Mello dropped off. He's on that bad Wi Fi. I I see if yeah. he come back in. But uh, man, let's hey, take a look man. at some some of the comments, man. Let's take a look at some of the ooh Calipari, hey, yeah. Arkansas. Yeah, I'm gonna wait for I'm gonna wait for uh, our boy Melo to get back on here so I can argue on JP behalf because uh you know he used us. It could have been real information. <laughs> you know, it could have been he actually acted like he wanted the job. And then out of nowhere, he was like, psych, where that extension at? So, you know, mm. give, give our boy JP some, you know, some slack. Mm. Absolutely. All right, we got Melo back in here. All right, Melo. Man, we ain't, we ain't cutting him no slack, brother. It's <laughs> over. He got these people hooks <laughs> up like he knew what he was talking about. No, no slack. Mm-mm. And so, with you, Jay, uh, DZ. Hey, and then uh, Big Bro with the head. Hey, Chris Beard already under contract. I don't know why you keep saying he got to sign another contract. He already under contract. No, no what I'm saying, but okay. but he's got a buyout, though. That's what I'm saying. You, I mean, he, he right now at this point, he can – all of them going to have a buyout clause in their contract. doesn't matter how yeah. – I mean, if he's under one, he can still be on the buyout. It's over for Beard, bro. If Beard was coming, they would have got Beard right when it happened, bro. They already had it like Hunter. already knew what he was doing. And Beard them closed that door on them, man. But mm. if he had a Kyle Perry, so, if he had a Kyle Perry, though, we, we back. I was just finna say, so how you feel about old Cal coming here, man? Because I know you around my age, so I know you with it. Bro, that's the one of the best coaches in the whole country. No matter what. No Come matter on, what. Man. Kyle Perry gives you a chance to be the best team in the country every year. And it's proven he's been the best, one of the best teams in the country every year. Mm. And he got we brought your nemesis on. He got a chance to play for a national championship every year, too. Kyle Perry. He give you a shot mm. every year. What up, Coach Box? What's up? Box, your boy Tang said no to us. What's up? The reason Tang... I know the reason Beard said no is because they lowballed him. They told him five million because they had a two million dollar buyout. Beard said no. That's when the board of trustees went back and say up that offer. Now if it's too late, I don't know. That's the reason Beard didn't come. Tang was just using us to get a get a contract. He wasn't coming nowhere. Wait, Will Way should have been Will Way should have been a coach tired. All right. So check this out. I just looked at some some info somebody sent to me. And it says, if Calipari leaves for another head coaching job, his buyout is zero. What you mean? His buyout is zero. If they fire him without cause, they owe him. 75%? Yes. So yeah, they okay. say his, his buyout is nothing. Mm. How? How is that possible? Hey, man. Oh. oh. Oh, what you mean? How is possible? Kyle Perry run his contract. He made that possible. What you yeah, mean? Yeah, he made that possible. Is, it's zero. It's nothing. They don't. If he oh, leaves snap. for another job, the the other school ain't got to buy him out. Oh Kyle snap! Perry. That's that's a player. That, that, that's a good little caveat. And can't nobody be paid more than him. Everybody he got to get paid at least a dollar uh, more than everybody. Like, come on, yeah. man. It's Kyle Perry, yeah. man. Yeah, but yeah. what we gonna do? What, what, what we gonna do? Get to the first round and lose? 
Mm-mm. So, so box, what? you weren't here. So I'm gonna I'm gonna come to you and ask you this question, man. What's your thoughts on Calipari, man? We want to know. Don't nobody want him. It's time mm. for him to retire. Do you do you believe me and Box is actually in agreement? Mm. That's how you know it's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? I wish I had my yeah, sound it, effects. Well, y'all, uh, y'all, yeah, uh, y'all are y'all are young guys. Look at all these players he getting. He the hype coach. He friends with Drake. He friends with LeBron. That ain't bringing no championship. They, they bring, they're bringing first round exits. Mm. Hey. <laughs> Mm. Then bring me Drake and LeBron to oh, oh, uh, but hold up, Bob. W. Come on now. Drake and what? LeBron are coming it. to Arkansas, bro. Drake and LeBron is not coming to Arkansas. They go to Kentucky. You won't see them in Arkansas with Calipari. Why why don't you, you they will? Why don't you want him, Box? Why 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 do we want him? No, no. I want you That's, to give me a, a solid reason, not the the typical box answer. Don't nobody want him. I want you, where's your reason? Why don't you well, want him? When 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 Bobby Knight left Indiana, he went downhill. I agree. Because his time was up. I agree. Not in Calipari. Time done, ain't, time, ain't time done the passed Calipari by. You know who took you know who took Calipari's spot? Bobby Hurley. The dude that whatever his name, Danny Hurley. He done took Calipari's spot. You can coach. Oates, Oates, Oates done took Dan Dan I mean Bobby I mean Calipari's spot. There's a couple more people done took Calipari's spot. Mm. So, so you saying he's just trying to live off his limelight now? That what he's trying. To, I mean, Kentucky want him gone. They not ever ever came for him to come back. What do you think about that? If he was that great, if he was that great, if he was that great, Kentucky wouldn't let him just leave like that. The whole fan base want him gone. Why? Because they tired of first round exits. They tired of disappointments with five star talent. That's what they tired of. He don't have the most talent. He he done had the most talent than any coach in college history. And what do we got to show for it besides a one, maybe two championships? It's one. One championship. John 16, I think, think. Think about that. He had Derrick Rose. Cal no, got two, more uh, than 2012. one championship, bro. Cal ain't got huh? but two. He got more he than one championship. One. He didn't he got two. He didn't win. He got he one champion. Got, he might got one. That's that's what he, he got one. Anthony Davis. Though. In 2012. Anthony Davis. Yeah. yeah. 2012. So what make him so so spectacular? How? I rather have Will Wade. Give me a 41 uh, year old. Give me a 41 year old that that's motivated. Will Wade ain't not, nothing. Bro, if you if if you don't know Will Wade, if you don't know, know his what? history, if you don't know I, Will Wade, don't know his history. Don't sit on here and act like you know. Because when I you do. say Will Wade, when you say Will Wade is a trash coach, you that mean you don't know nothing. What he do? He ain't won. What he do? You ain't said nothing. What he do? That's, hey, that's all. That's all I need to hear right there. I ain't got nothing to say to you tonight. If you're trying to dab down, you know what? Everybody in America say Arkansas is stupid. If they don't have Will Wade. Except, except Melo. Except Melo. Okay, you can say everything Kyler Perry done did, bro, but you can't say nothing that Will Wade done did, bro. Come on, bro. <laughs> We're going to let y'all go at it just a minute. I'm going to read this super chat. Boss Hawk said Melo was about to cook. Well, he about to get his chance to cook. We going to get him a chance. Melo, get your thoughts together. We about to come to you and let you and Box talk about this thing. Hey, we going to give uh, Tanya um, Emerson. We appreciate you. Thank you for supporting the channel. She says, uh, they better get this right or they will be looking for a job. 100%. Absolutely. Now, coming back. All right. So my question to Box and Mello, I'm going to go to Mello first. We're going to give you a chance to cook, Mello. Why do you say Will Wade is not the guy? All right. Uh, I'm looking out here on my notebook. Uh, Will Wade, zero SEC championships. And he was in the SEC. Um, zero NCAA wins. Zero Sweet 16s. Zero Elite Eights. Mm. What we talking no, we talk like we will win one of them. Do? What? Mm. What? Because he won games. Like what? Everybody won games. What he done did though? He ain't did mm. nothing. You can say Tang done did something. You can say Beard done did something. Bro, Will Wade ain't did nothing. He might be a good coach. He might be an okay recruiter, bro. But he ain't like that. Like y'all act like he's like that. He ain't did he won nothing. 
Come on, bro. Mm. And if you watch the game box, you can understand they're not listening to these other people. They're going to tell you whatever. Bro, Will Wade ain't won nothing. I bet. And mm. then, hold on. And then you say you want nobody, bro. I bet if Kyler Perry, bro, every college in the country will take Kyler Perry, bro. Every college. They'll get rid of their coach, except you can. Yeah, right. Hello, turn wow. the fan on because you cooking. You cooking. Yeah, you cooking, man. Hey. Hey, he had his notebook, man. He had some stats for you, uh, Box. So, uh, what say you? Nothing. He took an LSU team that ain't did nothing since since Shaq left, and made them and made them respectable. That's what he did. Whatever LSU did since Shaq left, nothing. Will Wade come and make them respectable? He took a Magnet State team before he even coached a game. They lost twenty three games last year. He said we will win twenty three plus this year. That's a coach. Will Wade, Will Wade is a better recruiter than anybody we done had, including Muffs. Now, who going who gonna, who gonna to argue the fact that Will Wade can't recruit? Who going to argue the fact that Will Wade can't, can't coach? Will mm. Wade ain't asked for $5 million. Well, well, what's, your, what's your rebuttal to the fact that he ain't, he ain't won nothing? Name some coaches who have. Oh, uh, <laughs> because a lot of coaches out there. Name some, who, name some, hey, name some who really is that John Calipari? Calipari? <laughs> right? John, John Calipari been around for ages, thirty-two years to be exact. He got one championship to show for it, one. In a bunch of, he got a bunch of hype, a bunch of hype, and thirty-two years in two programs that he burned to the ground. And who knows what's gonna happen when he leave to Kentucky? Hey man, he just had a couple bad relationships, man. Come on, man. Is, a couple is he, is, every, everywhere is you go, okay? when you leave, <laughs> guess what? Just had a bad relationship. Yeah, you on in, you know, that team on NC sanctions. You uh, UMass, he paid he paid Marcus Camby. I already said that. Memphis, he had Derrick Rose, didn't go to class, academically ineligible, still was playing. He ain't got caught in I Kentucky because guess what? Kentucky good about covering up their mess. Mm. I, They've I been playing players in Kentucky. You ain't telling me they ain't. Hmm. Hey, hey, man. On, He's doing everything Wait right, minute, OD. Wait a minute. I ain't it's trying to hear that. Of schools, <laughs> hey, it's a lot of schools that needed a head coach this year. Nobody came at John Kelly Perry to get him to be that coach. Because he worked for Kentucky. We don't know that. <laughs> Bro, that's what, that's what I'm going to tell you. When, 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 you are, when you're a coach of Kelly Perry status supposed to be, People are going to talk. The way they found out that he, re- that Arkansas want him, people are going to talk regardless of what he's saying thing or not. Don't did nobody want him. Even la- even last year when they when <laughs> Texas fired Beard, they got the money to pay Caleb Perry. They didn't get. They didn't. They didn't want him either. Mm. Hey, mm. I got. One we got. We got unbiased in the unbiased. building, man. Unbiased. What up, boss? Help us make sense of this, man. I want you all to close your eyes. And, and imagine <laughs> you wake up the next day and John Calipari, John Calipari is your coach. Are you mad? <laughs> I ain't Open mad. your eyes. Are you mad? I ain't mad. No, I'm not mad. I ain't mad. Nobody's going. Come on, but I ain't, I ain't. I ain't really just happy about it. Okay, now hey. this is a beautiful thing. I gotta throw a shot at Box real quick because you know what Box always said he want. I want to get some SEC championships. Give us a chance to win. If you go look at Kyle Perry's record, he's always at the top of the top, isn't he? He how many SEC championships does he have there, brother? Uh, uh fifteen. Um, it, that, that's pretty consistency, and I have a chance to win one. Oh, Is no, that what you said you won the box? Yeah, got eighteen well, conference championships. No, Kyle Perry giving you SEC everything tournament. you want. He's the epitome of what you want. When you talk Bro, about you think, box, if you think Kyle Perry gonna be here ten years, you crazy. We'll be looking for another coach yeah. in three years. Nobody Why has is been that? here 10 years. <laughs> Must have <laughs> been here for half that. Well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Well, how, how long was um, <laughs> Nolan Richards here? Y'all, that's the next coin phrase. Because you, you say nobody. How many, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Nolan Richards here? I think he was 11. Uh, is 11 that or 12. Who? Nolan? No, no, no. No, I'm... Thir- is it, uh, Nolan, been, I think Nolan was there at least 17 years, I want to say. Did he come at 87? No, he was there before '87. You sure about that? I'm about to find out. Yeah, we about to find out. 
I don't think it was 87 to 99. Let's see how good my off the top is. He got he got here in 85. 17 86. years, bro. Just like I said. Yep, 17. Okay. Well, mm -hmm. I was off too. Man, don't talk to me about but, Nolan. Anyway, I gotta read my super <laughs> read my super chat. <laughs> <now>. Hold on. <laughs> hey man, shout out Little Rock 2517. He said, man, find us Appreciate a coach. You. Flex on him. Man, I'm telling you. Appreciate Thanks you for supporting the channel. Baby. Supporting the channel, man. Uh, Ken Phillips, I wish they take Coach Cal. He could get top recruits. He's better than a than most names thrown around. I don't Walker, won't Walker, Jans, or Wade. Yeah. Well, thank you. Do you, do you hear that noise? Yeah, I hear it. That's Deezy. Oh. Hey, read that comment by Eddie Congress. Man, it's a, it's a, it's a gang of comments in there. I, 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 bro, it is. So it, it's this it's is a lot of what it, he bro. said. This is what he said. What's he his said, name? Cal does Cal doesn't have 15 SEC titles. He's been at UK 15 years. So how can he have 15 SEC titles? That's what I'm going to ask. Who said it? No, we're talking about I mean? as a no. That was, that was him as a coach, as a head coach at all three of those schools. Oh, coaching career. From uh, UMass, Memphis, and Kentucky, not just at Kentucky. Oh, yeah, that was his overall. That's I was saying his overall as a as a head coach. Mm. But I'm sure he got at least what four or five SEC championships. It don't matter. Would that be safe yeah. to say? Can save it. it doesn't matter. Save it. He yeah, ain't nobody, ain't nobody check. I'm sorry, he got six. I'm not checking for uh, John Calipari, bro. I'm just not, bro. That's I mean, cause you're a hater, OD. That, I mean, that's just say that. Say that. The reason why I told him, the reason I, I told him, I am the reason a hater why of John Calipari. You are absolutely know, that's what I'm 100% saying. right. You that's what I'm saying. So, Bob, bro, he just mad because when John yeah. Calipari was playing the Razorbacks, we he always had a <laughs> superior team. We might have been close, but we would get beat. And sometimes, I mean, it was a big deal when we did beat him. It shouldn't have. I mean, it wasn't like we, we we charging the court, all that when we beat them. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, man. I just think that if if he was available, bro, come on, man. I think y'all. I think y'all just want anybody. Right yeah, now. I mean, I think that the same I thing, mean, man. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hire the dude that's been beating. I mean, I'm just not gonna hire the dude that's been beating me, bro. It's just like the. It's like the Bears going to say, you know what? I'm gonna take Aaron Rodgers. No, kill yourself. I don't want him on my team. I'm not gonna ever. I'm gonna find a new team. I don't want Aaron Rodgers, bro. I don't want. I don't want that fool ever. I don't want. I wouldn't want Brett Favre ever in a Chicago Bears uniform. So why am I gonna hire the dude who's been beating the brakes off me for thirty years? No, I don't want him. I don't want him, bro. I'm sorry. That's just how I feel. That's, that's same thing with KD. People don't look at him the same. They don't, they don't give him credit for winning two championships because he already went to a championship team. Now, if he had won at Oklahoma State, that'd be different. But he got two championships. How you love that? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. At the end of the day. Thank you. Hey, give me Will, at the end of the day, he got two rags, and they stinked hey, on give, it. Ooh. Give me Will, hey, give me Will so, Wade, and he can win his first in Arkansas. So, it, so you mean to tell me <laughs> buying the championship is better than actually grinding and working for the championship? That's basically what y'all young bucks saying on here. We not saying it's better. We saying it's the same. It's the same thing. <laughs> it's not the same, bro. You it's made it the to the pinnacle. That's the that's the goal. Period. <laughs> but you know what, Box? I don't want to even uh, throw shade, but I'll take Will Wade. If it's Wade, I will take Wade, bro. I, I see your argument in regards to Wade. You y'all dogging that Calipari. I'm like whatever, because the fan base will be excited if if, if Calipari is the coach tomorrow. Period. That's a, that's a fact. It'll energize the base. It will be to get players on a, a on a zero player team just about. So that's the best way you can spark being able to get an actual roster if you have John Calipari for the short term. Be honest with you, but Will Wade long term might be better. That's fair to also mm. point out too. The reason I want one thing back. When the, I, reason when I the reason Caleb Perry back. won't work, wait a minute, the reason Caleb Perry won't work, and this going to be facts, is because the booster's not going to shell out any of money like Kentucky do. So Caleb Perry won't work in Arkansas. <laughs> oh, my gosh. 
<laughs> oh my God! Didn't what? you hear say money wasn't the issue? That's what they yeah, say. Yeah, that's what they, they say. The right money's people want to spend the, the money. They gonna spend hey. the money, bro. Hey, I can say I'm a billionaire until you see I ain't one. <laughs> hey, hold up, man. I want I want you guys to do me a a, a solid before we let the show go on, continue. We on YouTube. We got 411 people, almost 300 on Twitter. I want the 411 people in here right now kicking it with us, hanging out with us. Close out the chat for just two seconds. Hit that like button for us. Make sure you run it up. Make sure you help us hit that algorithm so they can keep pumping out the Woo Pig podcast. Let them know, hey, man, we doing good things over here. We appreciate everybody for, for rocking with us. If you haven't, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hey, follow us everywhere, social media. Make sure you follow us. We everywhere, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, wherever. Run it up for your boys, man. We appreciate all y'all. Now, jumping back over here. Oh, uh, hold on. I got a super chat. I don't want that one. Uh, did I read? Yeah, I read that one. Hey, great day, man. We appreciate you supporting the channel. He says, I don't think appreciate Coach Cal you. is going to be focused solely on recruiting five-star freshmen anymore. He acknowledged after the loss to Oakland that he relies too much on freshmen. Hey. He telling y'all, man, he trying to come up. He trying to get away from there, man. He tired of that pressure of having to win every single year. He trying to go to, to the Arkansas so he can go to the relaxing community. And he ain't gonna man. do nothing. And I'm sorry, he ain't winning jack. Hey man. He ain't winning jack, bro. I'm sorry. Now right, y'all can say what you want to say. He not. Hey, can I ask a question real quick? Box, I'll right, go ahead. Didn't did, did you say you said we are way the better recruiter than Muzz? Is that what you said? You talking about me? No, but box him. We'll way prove that at LSU. That's facts. Hell. They name that's, name three hey, players that you, you, you gonna do, got. Hey, you should have put that on your notebook. That's facts. Who? That's what I'm doing. I, I got it in my <laughs> that's notebook. That's all I'm gonna hey, say. It, it's, you should have right put here. that in your notebooks. I got it. I got it. Who who you who Will Wade done got? You should have put that in your notebooks. Who have Will Wade <laughs> got other than Ben Simmons? Who you know Will Wade got other than Ben Simmons? He didn't coach Ben Simmons. Then who you know he got? Who he get? Look at your uh, go go Google. Yeah, I know you don't know nobody you guys. You just nobody. Running your mouth. Cam Thomas is definitely a good player that he has. Cam Thomas. He's challenging you, bro, and you you got to you got to stand up in the barbershop. You can't just say it, man. Well, you're proof at. Greg, one thing about me, I ain't got to stand up to nobody. Hey, man, prove what you said. Prove what you said. I promise you. I'm just proving you up here talking. Stand up to nobody. <laughs> I'm gonna stand on what I say and I mean what I hey, see. I'm and just pulling bro. Out. And his little and his little his little dollar store notebook ain't gonna change that. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm gonna I'm reply to this well, comment, man, hey, from, from hey, Robert Jefferson. Be... He said, OD, would you not take Nick Saban if Pittman left today? Hey, you you remember the uh, on the uh, on Friday, the very first one, when uh Craig was talking to uh his boy who got beat up by uh, Debo. He said, "Man, uh, Debo uh, choked me in, in smoke backyard, and oh, y'all yeah. didn't even help me." And what Red said, say? "Oh, that was different. Oh, that that's was different. different. <laughs> we talking about Nick Saban and Sam Pittman. That's different. Uh, oh, that's oh, that was different. <laughs> oh, that was different. <laughs> hey, Nick Saban want to be a hog oh, breaking ball because hey, Sam Pittman mm -hmm. got to go. <laughs> yeah." Oh, that was hey, good. let me tell y'all something about these dudes on the bottom of us right now. If you you ever heard of moving the goalposts, they the kings of it. <laughs> the kings. Thank you. <laughs> hey, hey, Deezy. I'm hey Deezy. I'm just here to show that box up. Just an old man that like to talk, man. Just an old man that like to talk. That's why I'm here, man. Hey. Old man hey, like to talk. hey, box ain't no, but he's smarter than you, but that, I, I <laughs> <laughs> oh, you supposed to be oh, you supposed to be smart hey, than me. Hey, hey, box show his face. You show your you show your braids. That's the difference between hey, box and mellow. Like, hey, we just barely can I see your eyebrows. Face. That's the difference between oh, mellow and box. <laughs> bro, you at home, I don't have bro. to, I don't have to have when I talk. I don't hey, have to nah. scream with everybody. He at work, man, man, man. Bro, he at work, man. So he, 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 he at work, go in the bathroom so you can show your face. Don't hide out loud. 
Ain't nothing wrong with being an old man that like to talk. My grandpa like to talk too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I talk to the old man all the time. Wow. Hey, wow. that's cool. <laughs> Hey, yeah, box y'all funny got, tonight. Hey, box to, hey, box ain't got to get a notebook to remember stuff either. I got to. I, <laughs> you need to remember the Melo two players. Hey, but hey, <laughs> like I said, you still ain't named nobody Will Wade done recruited. You talking about he better than Mus? Come on, man. Quit they, that. Hey, hey, Put your, that your nerd boy, um, hey, your boy unbiased that just t- that, that, that's on your side just told you one. Did you not hear he him? He told me one. He told me one. I heard him. Well, I'm talking that's to you, enough. though. That's no. enough. Okay. Enough. Okay. You, you, want tell you, you want me to tell you why? You want me to tell you why? Mm-hmm. Out of everybody must put in the NBA, Cam, Cam Thomas is doing the most damage. He a good player. He a good player. Mm. Let me read my super chats, man. Y'all boys is on one tonight. Uh, DJ Hall. Thank you for supporting appreciate the channel, you. man. We appreciate it. He says, uh, Bet Cal has 20 or 30 wins. Then cars, box sold. Just talking ish, box. All love, bro. <laughs> they shooting shots at your box, man. You know how yeah, it go if, in the barber shop. DJ, if DJ Hawk, if DJ Hawk know me, he know Cal can never sell would get more wins than I sell cars. Not happening. <laughs> he know that's when he said. It. Hey man, hey, all the halls coming at you right now, man. We got boss hall. Said box just Boss talking high. with no evidence. Bro, <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Box put in the box. Hey, if you, if you want to know a wishy washy dude, that's Boss Hall because he'll be on my side next week. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe you'll make a good point. <laughs> hey, shout out to my bro, Hallwell Podcast, man. Y'all yo, go yo, check yo. him out. He's doing big things over there, man. He said, hey, yes, bro, y'all not even discussing the common denom- denominator and all this stuff. Y'all got this barbershop conversation burning in my spirit tonight. Hey, man. Uh, man. For the channel, man. We appreciate you. Man. Appreciate you, man. Kicking it Hold up us, now. Man. Let's you go back to this. Go. He says, y'all not even discussing the common denominator in all this stuff. Hey, Mo. Hey, hey, Mo don't, don't throw rocks and hide your hands, man. Pull up. What's the, yeah, what's the, what's the we, common we denominator? We want to know what this common denominator is, man. I don't he's, talking know. About, yeah. he, he's talking about Hunter. Uh, what's the common denominator? Hunter, uh, Hunter Yurichick. Hunter yeah, Yurichick. I mean, what's the com- the common denominator? So what? I mean, it is the executive's job to hire the head coaches. Everybody knows that. So he was out here. He better. He should have been out here whenever he knew because he didn't just find out about Mus on that Friday that he was going. They've been talking about this man for maybe a couple of weeks or something. So I'm sure. I mean, a smart AD would have been had already had some feelers out there. So if he misses this, if he whiffs this, man, it's it's gonna be a it's it's bad for it's bad for him. So to me, that's the common denominator. What say you, unbiased? I want to ask a question. What would you grade if he had John Calipari as the coach on a grade of A to F? Where would I grade that higher? Yep. I mean, that's a. I mean, I wouldn't call it an A plus higher, but it, it is a a list. Higher, if that makes sense. Okay. Box. I think 10 years ago it'll be A plus. Right now it's a B plus. Too old. Okay. He don't lost his, he don't lost his touch. I mean, I mean, I'm, let's keep it a buck, man. Oh, I mean, Calipari is the fine girl that I mean, she the no, she the six children, no husband, beauty queen, bro. That's what she is, bro. <laughs> it, it, don't nobody want her no more. <laughs> it's a wrap. She a, it's a great? rap, man. Right. She's six What's children, no husband, beauty queen, man. Don't nobody want Coach Cal, bro. I'm sorry. How you? Grade? Do what hit your grade? Mm-hmm. <laughs> this might be so weird. So I just want to get your grade. My grade if we hire John Calipari? Yeah. Yep. I give it, I give it a B minus, bro. I give it a B minus. <laughs> you had to squeeze the blood <laughs> on the turtle. Mellow? Yeah, yeah, it could be minus. Uh, I give it A plus, best hire we ever made in Arkansas history. Dang. Dang. How, how, oh. is that, how is that when we had Nola Richardson? That don't make sense. Oh. Yeah. They both got the same championships. Black. Stop it. Dang. A easy A. And I got a question off of your question. And I want to know. So, around. I mean, wait a minute. So, why, why, wait a minute. So, why do we have to get the grade? What's up with that? 
because if it's a possibility, if he's hired, how you feel to get the sentiment of the fan base? Let me see because it's a possibility. Yeah, I mean, me? I'm, I'm, I'm seeing some rumblings. I'm, I'm, I go if I hop off and go, I see the rumblings is is raw. So I'm just want to put it out there. So how you feel if this actually ends up being the case? Hmm. Hey, I'm biased. I got something that's gonna tie your question all all together. What grade would y'all give Muss's time here? Mm, box. I, we'll start with box on that one. Box. I give him a B plus because he left. B plus. I'm I'm biased. No what say you? You. I gave him a B plus too. The way he left mm. ruined it with him being an A, but it's a B plus. Mello. I give him an A. Hmm. O D. I'm sorry, what was the question, man? I, you know, I was doing my uh, thing over here. I know, that's why I, I got it. Uh, what was what Musselman's grade as a coach here? Um, Man, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going to go A minus, man. A minus? A minus. Do you already answer it, Dizzy? Nah, but I'm going to give Mus uh, A minus, B plus. Yeah. I, I give Musselman's tenure here a B plus. So that's the answer to your question. So mostly, I mean, he got a passing grade. So he wasn't a bad coach. We just didn't like the way we broke up. You know what I mean? That's what that's that's what it feel like to me. We just we mad because, you know, you just I just came home and the lots changed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm gonna read my super chats and then we're gonna come to Mo. Uh give me just a let me run this down here. Uh, the UL underscore guy, he says, OD, we welcome Patino here after he smoked us for years when he was at UK. Once again, y'all want to win or nah? Ooh. Oh. Mm. Talk. Shots fire. Hey, man. Shots hey, fire. UL guy, man. Bro. Hey, man. I, I, don't, want, I don't want Aaron Rodgers on the Bears, man. I don't <laughs> want no Rick Patino in the Razorbacks. <laughs> I'll take it. I don't want it. Uh, I'll cheer it on. Hey, Boss Hog says, Will Wade had only three top 100 players, Efton Reed, Justin Williams, and Gerald Colbert. Facts. Mm. Hey, <laughs> he's shooting shots at you, uh, Box. He, he, he only talking to you on this one. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mo. Just, just I don't, I don't know if we hear you good. Say, say something for us. Can, what up? What up? Can y'all hear me? Yeah, it's not coming through your it's mic. Solid. No, you're not. It ain't coming through my. Oh, I know what's <laughs> it, going on. It's not coming through your mic. So we are gonna come back to you while you, while you get that that audio together. Somebody said in this box, in a box voice. You know what box voice is? Wait a minute. 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 We gonna get a shirt, a Woo Pig podcast shirt with that on the back. I think that's the next <laughs> shirt we are gonna make. Is wait a minute. Everybody gonna know that's Box's word. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I but, think I got it right. All right, so now, all right, yeah, you do. It sound like you good now. Now, Mo, talk to what us up? about this common denominator that we think you're talking about, which is hundred year a check, man. You said man. we ain't talking about it, so let's talk about it, y'all. Hey, we as a fan base have let hundred year a check slide on a lot of situations, bro, including this one, like. We all have come to the conclusion that Hunter Yurichek knew he was like he knew that Musselman was leaving, point blank, period. But for you to not be prepared after that to have your your next coach ready to go immediately after that, that's on Hunter Yurichek. And let's take this all the way back to when Sam Pittman was stinking it up last season, man. You don't have enough buyout money to get rid of him, and you then don't even have another coach lined up when you know he's stinking it up. That's on Hunter Yurichek, bro. The, was Dan was Dave Van Horn here when you, Hunter Yurich, was he already here when Hunter Yurichek got here? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, he been here. Exactly, and we we can't put Chad Morris on Hunter Yurichek. We can't. I'll give him that. He did bring Musselman here, but he knew Musselman was leaving, bro. And he is whiffing on all of these coaches. There is no reason especially because Arkansas got the money in basketball, bro. We got money to spend on what we want to spend it on. Everybody got that's, that. You know what I'm fact. saying? If you want to spend some money on something, you're going to find a way to get that bread. But for you to let Beard get away, Tang, we ain't even really want Tang. He just a nice name. You know what I'm saying? Mm. 
It's a good thing he a brother, you know what I'm saying? But either way, Beard was the guy. Bro, schools like Ole Miss, Missouri, all these teams, they getting right right now. You know what I'm saying? Arkansas falling behind in everything other than baseball, soccer, and track. You feel me? <laughs> That's the only we, we smoking in right now. But as far as the, the – and the best thing we got going right now for football is, is, is Bobby Petrino. Just think about where we would be as a football team right now if we had a retained Sam Pittman and we didn't bring in Bobby Petrino. Mm. Is that a hundred year check decision or was that really a Sam Pittman decision? That's the question. Because if Sam Pittman don't win, hey man, three stop the press. Stop the hey. press. Fox 16 News is reporting John Calipari is the new men's basketball coach at the University of Arkansas. No. Nah. Wow, no. No, no. Hey, bro, it's on their website, Little Rock Sources, Arkansas Razorback Zero. Hold up, man. I see it. It just oh, happened. Ooh. Man, oh. just boy John Calipari. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's out here. You. Oh, man, it's going down then. Hey, I ain't, oh. man. Oh, they. I told y'all they said it wasn't that about nothing about no money. Ooh, now, the, hey, he, oh, hey, 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 hey. Now, hey. now, now, Mo. Uh, 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 Mo. Uh -oh. Mo. You got to walk it back. You got to walk it back. I ain't walking everything back. <laughs> hey, y'all had this conversation burning in my spirit because I had to come and hunt a year check directly, bro. Man. You know you done released these videos of you on the bus. You're still here. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. You gotta have your you gotta have your backup ready for your backup. You know what I'm saying? Well, that's a that's Especially a heck of a backup. Mm -hmm. Hey, Calipari is a W. You know, man, what I'm that's saying? a win. W's. You feel me? Yeah, that's 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 point, a power point, period. Move. Yeah, that's a power move right there. I can't even front. Ooh, man, I, I can't see even you. Can I say something hey. to you, OD? What up, man? I'm 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 here with it, man. We we cooking together, man. Yeah, this. this now I'm going to tell you this: some of the people that decommitted will recommit. Oh, he don't want them though. He got a clean slate. Imagine this: he they got a clean slate, but some people he gonna probably want to keep. So, but, you think, just, but, just, but think about it though, unbiased. Um, what he better? Has a, a castle Bro, he can pay. Hold hold on just a second. So you talking about you, you gonna give OD? Calipari all these players jumped out? All of these players jumped out of the uh, and jumped out. So you quit on the you quit the team when you you entered the that, portal. That matters. This is a business, man. That don't matter right bro, now. He's he don't want none of those scrubs back. You know he, he for the money that's bro, allocated for him to pick hey. what players. And if they the right fit, and they can ball. It's going hey. down, hey, bro. That's a power move. That's a power move right there, bros. I ain't even hold on. Just say, hey, Coach Box, what you? How you feeling? How you feeling, Coach Box? Let's get the fresh oh. out the press. I mean, it don't matter if cause the boosters don't open up their pocketbooks. It don't matter. They obviously yeah. did. That's they, I, I, I told you it wasn't about the money box. I ain't talking about. They got color They obviously spend bread. They spend bread, bro. They spent bread. I'm talking about for players. That's coming next. Uh, yeah. Yeah, came we heard that, that, we heard that. We heard that last year. He wouldn't have came if it wasn't happening. It, was, it, was, it wasn't Calipari. You know what I'm saying? Let me ask Box a question. About? They ain't bring him over here to play spend mid major money, bro. What are you talking about? They bringing Calipari over here without a contingency, without a budget. Bro, I can tell you, I'm gonna give you a thousand dollars. You come down and sit in my house for ten minutes, but I ain't gotta give it to you when you get it. Calipari ain't getting a thousand dollars. He get, hey, he gonna probably get eight point five million. Mean, that's, hey, but that's they a ain't playing no games Mr. right now. Look like that's that's a that's, that's, that's a talking about? speech, Mister Unbiased. That's mm -hmm. Hey, y'all okay. hey, know y'all know what box sound like. His hair is whack. His shoes is whack. But me, I'm hey, this tight. That's the thing. If Caterpillar come, come, come here and win at a high level and we got the first round, that's cool. We all wanted to win. But there's still a lot of variables that got to happen just because just, just, just when he get here, not just because he here. There's a lot what of variables. Are we worse off, are we play worse play off or better off, Box? Hey, you are we worse off or better off? That's a that's a great I, question, though, Bias. I still, that's a great I question. Still, I still rather have Will Wade because I don't think Cal Perry gonna be here five years. Man. Are we worse off or better off right now? What say you, Box? 
I he hate like to say it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, he, hey, he hates I to say not, it. What's the answer like to the question, beard. though? What's the answer to the question, Box? I think we've been better off with a beard. No, we answer are we, we is, is the program in a better or worse position? It don't matter. We ain't got no players. We ain't, we ain't answer, answer the question, question box. box. Answer the question, box. Hey, you see what answer. you see what Sam answer. Jones just J Jones just put down there. Cal got the number two recruiting class. He he talking to unbiased, but you can bet your bottom dollar that all of them players coming to the University of Arkansas. Yes, every last one of them. They gonna decommit from Kentucky and they come into Arkansas. They come into Arkansas. Hey, so box, argue with answer the question. Are they better? Is the program if better? Play, if all them players come, yes. <laughs> you, you always gotta. He, he cannot have a he simple gotta yes or no. Out with everything. Uh, uh, hey, hey, what I you would, got, uh, 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 Mello? I would, like thank, I would like to thank Coach Musselman, the Musselman family. You know what I'm saying for yes, what y'all did for us moving out the way. So call it Craig. Come through here, man. Hey, man. Like, yeah, what? Hey, oh, man, we up. Hey, Melo, drinks on me. You're going to have to call in for the rest of the night. Drinks on me. Hey, look, I remember man, when Kyler Perry walk in, man, everybody get right. You hear me? Kyler Perry, yeah. dude, man. Y'all don't even understand. Yeah. Hey, I remember See, Kyler hey, Perry coaching. Hey, he pulling up with the Italian suit. All the other coaches got regular suits on, man. Y'all better quit. Yo, this, if this don't what? happen, the fan base is going to go to, yo, they're going to go through withdrawals. They're going to need to be like oh, in the yeah. darkest of dark corners. You ain't lying. Y'all got me hype. Y'all got me. Hey, JP, JP, <laughs> got me. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. Hey. Y'all got me. Wow. Boy, that's 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 big news, man. How you feel, man. O? How you feel, O? Hey, the the question is on the table is are we better off with Calipari oh, yeah. than Musselman? And it's a big fact. Box bro. Said, we, box we, it's, it's, yes. we are. We are. Yeah. So I can't be mad. We got a good coach. I I can't say he the guy that I wanted, but we got a good coach, man. I mean, yeah, he's a proven winner. He ain't never had a losing season. We had a losing season this year. Hold up, we so got a We definitely through. better. Where's his official word at? Bro, I put I done posted it in the, in the deal. If Fox sixteen is reporting it, it's he's just facts. more credible than the than the Whoopi podcast. From where? Arkansas, from bro, from it's from Arkansas. Look in the chat. Everybody, I done put it in there two times. Everybody's reporting it right now, just not them. You know what I'm saying? So if they out here saying it, if Fox 16 out here, then put their name out here in these streets, they don't put their name yeah. on nothing without it being legit. Yeah. Now the Whoopi podcast and say we want to say. We ain't we ain't <laughs> no reporters. We just some fans talking <laughs> about basketball and football. We're journalists. <laughs> We're fabulous. Right. You know? We we YouTubers man. when it comes to the real. <laughs> man. So man. Paper player paper player talking about nothing official. Fake news. Man, fake man. box won't. box. Who else who else got it out there, box? Well, um I seen CBS had it on one thing I looked up. And it's a, so I mean, it's got it's some, so it's got it's, it's got some real burn. Got some legs to it. Hey, Jeremiah, appreciate the super chat, man. He said finally we got JC the Hogs. I don't know what JC the Hogs. Uh will know what winning John Calipari. On a, John Calipari. We got John Calipari to the Hogs. Okay. We'll know what winning on the regular feels like. Maybe we will start winning the conference. Facts. Mm -hmm. We going to win the conference. It may be a year or two, but it may not it may not take that long. Hey, shout out to my dog Matt, man. He said, I'll say this, no matter what happens next. It will be fun as H E double L hockey sticks to watch. We about to have yeah. real national eyes on us. Thank you. Man. That's what and that and listen, that adds prestige. That's why I'm looking at O D and Box Crazy. Cause the fan base is gonna be for the most part. We, we telling you how we feel about John Calipari. Now I know we gonna see. That's understandable. I'm just letting mm. you know what the deal is and what the you know the end all be all. What the real is. What we gonna be seeing because hey. the fan base is gonna be excited. Re remember yeah, this. The fan base is gonna be excited. Your favorite coach is a cheater. All these dudes are cheaters. 
Every last is, is one of them. Is that what we doing today? Is that what we, I'm we, just we, telling we you. High morality you, you, ground you, right you now? You sitting here, you sitting here smoking on that John Calipari right now. Hold but up, hold you up. just know that your favorite coach, no matter who he is, is a cheater. Every last one of okay. them. <laughs> but was that, would, you, would you be bringing that up if we had been on the show talking about Beard being the coach? They no, all cheaters, no. bro. I'm, no, th- man, this I whole, mean, you weren't in here when we was talking about this. Everybody yeah. was on on uh, old boy head, Will Wade, about Will him Wade. cheating. My point was, it don't matter who you bring in here. I they all, all cheaters, bro. That's, but why are we even talking about that right now? Right now, we should be talking about the, that's, the quality but, of the hiring. What well, it means for that's, our basketball team. Well, that's because right that, cause that was OD's the reasoning. The top 10 team for playing with me. Bro, that, um, bro, that was old. You missing the point, that, bro. You too busy trying to make point. your point and try to understand. O just didn't li- don't like him because of those reasons. You know what I'm saying? That's the reason why Odie don't like him. He, you know, he'll cheat like the rest of them. Well, yeah, they, they all cheaters. cheaters. Hey, that was 20 years ago, OD. You know, that, ain't, that ain't the point, though. What I'm saying is they all have cheated. I don't care who you bring in here. They all cheated. Hey, hey I know somebody who unallowed somebody, and they got out of jail after 20 years. Mm. Hey. All good, baby. He paid his time. <laughs> he did his time. <laughs> he brought it to the door with him, so you got to <laughs> let him go. He got the hat, man. <laughs> These are hey. hey. that he should be. Hey, hey, just because we don't like just because we don't like Kelly Perry, don't mean we ain't gonna support him when he's there. Yeah, right. I know. Y- hey, I don't know. Practice. First off, first off, you don't know what we're gonna do. We telling you what we're gonna do. You don't know nothing. We telling bro, you. You gotta support it, bro. Or you just a hater? Yeah, yeah. I mean, that, the hate, I mean, I mean, to hate on getting John Collar Perry, that, I mean, that would be just almost sac, I mean, just sacrilegious. Like, I mean, are you a fan? I mean, you, you envy the guy. That's what I'm telling. Oh, O didn't like him because he was building better teams at the time and they were where we wanted to be. And it, it just pissed OD off. He said, man, I hate that dude. Why are you hating him? Because he, he's doing good coach. Nah, man, he paying the player, blah, blah, blah. I know he is. I know he is. Okay, bro. And that's why OD don't like him. You can't say because he's a bad okay. coach. That's the only that's the only plug that, that OD has on why he don't like him. That's it. Mm. He, he ain't for the I, we, if we can't beat him, join him. That's what it is, too. That, you know what I'm saying? I ain't, that yeah. I, 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 ain't, I, ain't, I ain't that dude. I, I, I'm just, I'm just not I him. Respect it. I respect yeah, I, it. I ain't, you know, I don't like riding on nobody's coattail, bro. I mean, I'm, I'm just not that dude. So, I'm, I'm. That just, ain't riding no coattail. I mean, so guess what? I, at some point, no one keeps a job indefinitely. Yeah. I mean, it's very rarely that any of these guys are. 30 year guys or there that ain't that don't necessarily happen anymore. So it's always gonna be on somebody else's skirt tails. Whether or not it's good or bad. Head to head, who do y'all think the better coach, Muss or Calipari? Calipari. 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 Where we at with it then? We we are definitely a better program. I I disagree. I mean, I'm not disagreeing with you at all. We one hundred percent are. How much gas do y'all really got in the tank though? He's That's the question. If he how got four years, that's cool John? with me. I don't care about none of that. Four years. <laughs> Thank you, DZ. Give it. Hey. hey. If it's four years and we get there tomorrow, hours, I'll take it. <laughs> I could die tonight. Man, Coach Cal, y'all coach. I mean, that, that, that immediately give the, the university more clout. That's going to be more national games. It's going to be a whole lot more juice on campus. It's gonna be it's gonna be a lot of stuff because he gonna he come with an entourage. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Is Kentucky gonna hire though? That's because that's, Ooh, that's know, another great question. Fall, they get real spicy. I don't even a, care. I, they, they I can don't get, care they either. Get, but I'm just just to, you know how the dominoes flow in the coaching, you know, search yeah. and drink. But somebody uh, get another. Somebody gonna get a good job. Chris Burris still ain't signed nothing yet. Ooh, mm. we don't care about him no more. Kentucky, that's yeah. dirty. Yeah, we don't we don't care about Chris Beard no more. It's a done. No, no, it's a wrap. But I mean, it's just interesting to know because that's our competition. So we must know thy competition. Beard not a better coach than Kyler Perry. Uh, uh, who knows? I don't know. I mean, mm. Beard ain't been coaching thirty two years, so you can't really say that. 
You're right. Because because right. Beard yeah. technically can end up in Kentucky right now. Yep. Yep. Mm. That could be the he flip of it. He can actually end up in Kentucky right now. Yeah. Wow. It's some big shoes. Yeah, that means they got longevity with him. Mm. It's it's, big this, came, this came out of left field, though. I don't think anybody was expecting this. Bro, I was well, telling you, man, Saturday night, I was at a table with, with some folks, and before anybody would talk about it, he, he leaned over to me. He was like, yo, uh, they talking to Calipari. I was like, nah, dog. He was like, yeah, they talking to him. He showed me the text message. Yeah. And so I'm telling you, that was that. You just I, didn't that, have that, a show about it. I didn't want to bring it yeah. out. I was like, man, I'm going to let that slide for a minute. Yeah, I talk, I called OD and told him. Oh, you talked to him. You talked talk to, to him, him on the phone? Yeah. And he was telling them how he knew about it. Credible, was it not? Yeah. It wasn't JP, was No. <laughs> no, man. Hey, sources now. Make nah. it so. Make it so. Hey. But yeah, well, so. Yeah, it's, 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 a, it's, it's a beautiful thing, man. Yeah. Hey, I might just have to hey, send Hunter year chick made me now. eat some of my words, man. But he still ain't got no excuse Where? about saying Pittman. <laughs> hey, he made you do it. He made you he do it. He, he walked in bad. He walked, had to walk in bad. <laughs> yeah, he Hold up. Uh, go backwards. Why? I'm going to treat the Kentucky fans well just because of one post I read by accident. It was the first thing I seen. They said something that was really nice about Arkansas basketball. what they say? It was real. Well, if Cal is going to leave Kentucky for anyone, I'd be most at peace with Arkansas. <laughs> I really like that fan base. Great people are absolutely obsessed with basketball. Also, top one SEC environment. They treat Cal well. And deserve to be good and exciting. Big Blue Nation, Wu Pig Suey. Mm. Hmm. That was real. Hey, Sam Jones yeah. says Kelvin Sampson is 68. And last I checked, had the number one team for the last four years. That argument is dumb. Y'all know what they're for the rest of the party. Kevin <laughs> Sampson, I put in more work. I think this right. It, I, I more think this right here. My, more, yeah. Says more work Kevin Sampson. Kevin, Kevin Sampson did a lot of work to get Houston where they was. But Calipari been riding that sail for a while. Kevin Sampson did a lot of work to get Houston to that top spot. Mm. So recently, Kevin Sampson. Been Kevin Sampson. Look, but I, hey, hey, let's he can, can I talk? <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is what I'm gonna say. This is what I'm gonna say. I hope, I hope this right here light a fire under Calipari that he ain't had in years. Mm. It's like, it's like, it's like, you know, the same, the same woman over and over, but hey, the new duck, the new duck, <laughs> yeah. Mr. Touch a Bus. <laughs> hey, since, since we going there, hey, since we going there, if, if, if you've been with a woman a long time, she just don't want you to lay on the back of the mode. She won't do it on the counter. Calipari got tired. Now he can do it on the counter again and watch what we do. <laughs> Old Smiles Outdoors, man. Thank you for supporting the channel, man. He says, man, I'm jacked up. Woo Pig Suey. Let's go, boys. Yes, sir. Let me check, man. Let me. We got another super chat, man. Boss Hall. I want to believe it until I see I some dry ink on the paper. Man, said, I, I won't know. believe it until I see dry ink on the paper. Okay. I don't blame you, Boss Hall. I don't blame you. Hey. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's almost some unbelievable type stuff, though. You know what I'm saying? That's like a, like, for real? For real? Hmm. Yeah. I would have never thought that type of, because that immediately puts your program as a destination. Okay, now people going to come. They're going to come for the coach. There, there's kids that want to play for him. They'll come to Arkansas, see, I mean, and they might drive recruits in the future. So if you say he's only going to be there for four years, so maybe you can establish that uh, it's, a, it's, it's actually a great basketball destination. And guess what? Now your program starts to thrive within the SEC. So even if he leaves in five years. So that's how I feel about that. You know, are you you kind of feeling what I'm saying? Uh, unbiased, mellow. What you think? I want, 
I want to say something, G Hong. Hey, I want you to understand, bro. In basketball, maybe not in football, but in basketball, bro, it's more about the coach. It ain't really about the program, bro. In basketball, football may be different, but in basketball, bro, it's, it's always gonna be about the coach. We following, they following coaches. They're not following the program unless you're an in state okay. kid. You know what I'm saying? Unless you're an in state gotcha. kid. Yeah, Somebody yeah, man, that's a great take. Some, yeah, somebody just sent me a test message, and I did not know Kelly Perry was cool, 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 cool with the Tyson family. Oh yeah, we said that earlier. Remember, yeah, we were was, talking about that I, earlier. They that they was the bag. they dropped the bag. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I remember. Hey, so this is what I'm telling y'all. I told y'all over the weekend. I told OD, I uh, was on the phone with him. I said, "Man, we got word that this hire ain't got nothing to do with money. So whatever you know, when we start talking about, hey man, the money, man, it ain't got nothing to do with the money." You know what I like about this, though, in a certain way, considering that we, all the players, you know, decommitted, that he actually gets a chance to do some Picasso, paint his own pictures type of stuff. And it's going to be really fun and intriguing, and it's going to be ongoing through this whole upcoming months. It's going to be pretty exciting. I think the fan base and everybody yeah. engaged is going to have a lot of fun with this because it's going to be a lot of high-quality players that we're going to see that sometimes we might not even be used to. You might end up with two, three, four top 25 players coming at the same time and then with a few great transfers. You get, It's, it's going to be crazy, guys. Be ready. Yeah. Most of them, hey, I'm biased. I'm biased. Most of them did that already. Don't, don't do that. Uh, back what I was going to say. <laughs> uh, dang, y'all made me forget what I was going to say about doing all that talking. You got to write it down. You got you, you to write it down. Where your tablet is? <laughs> He called me down because I was trying to un underplay Musk and hype up Calipari because he must did have to be top 25. <laughs> so, I mean, so let me ask you guys a question. So, okay, w w there ain't no ink that's dry, but it's looking like it's really leaning toward Cal. And we right now, as of today, with Mark entering the, the portal, the only person that's on scholarship is uh, Trevor Brazil. Now, we all, I, one of the things that I said earlier, I don't know if you guys heard this, that I feel like Brazil was going to declare himself for that draft this year. That's what I feel like. That's why he hadn't gotten a portal. I think, you know, he's probably going to enter himself in, into the draft, which means that there's nobody on, truly on the roster at this point because everybody's gotten into the portal. How do you guys feel about a blank slate for John? Uh, you know, Coach Cal. Box. I think he get two players back. I think the recruit Shelly will recommit. I think he'll get five of his play players from Kentucky. Because this one freshman out of Florida, that's part of that one that one that one to commit to Kentucky. He probably gonna commit to Arkansas. Then you got to get like four or five, four by four more. You be good. Hmm. Mo? Man, I think a clean slate wouldn't be a bad idea. If Trevor still really wanted to reinsert himself into that, into that lottery pit conversation in Arkansas, especially because Calipari is going to have him operating in a real system. You know what I'm saying? One of, the, hmm. one of the things about Eric Musselman is that he did not have our team operating in a real system. It was like a free fall. A just just a, sp a spread of talent all over the court with no consistency or no direction. But I think Calipari is a little bit different, man, especially if he has really the number two recruiting class in the nation. I think that him bringing those guys in along with keeping Trevor Brazil and maybe some other big, we need a solid big man, no doubt. But I think a yeah. clean slate is a bad idea, not only for Calipari, but for Trevor Brazil too. And we need to keep Trevor mm. on Mark. Mm. I'm biased. Yeah. Tremont hit the portal. Yeah. What we'll say hey. you? Man, don't be surprised. Almost every player can't try to come back. Listen. I mean, but I don't think, but oh, I mean, let me, let me, at this me, point, they, they don't finish, want you. You got to let me finish the bars off. The, bar, let me, the wallets is open. Okay. They're going to spend money on the players. Battle, you said you need an IL. I think we might get you. We might got you, bro. Just hold tight. Keep it cool, you know. Everybody may not stay, but I expect some to. It will be four or five, four. Like I would say four players 
on the roster that's from Arkansas that will be on the team next year. Uh, at worst, three, I think. In regards mm-hmm. to like who is available right now, this the freshmen that be coming in and the players that's from last year would be at least a total of three, possibly four. We're going to get one or two guys to come back. I would bet mm. that with Cal. Mm. DZ, what say you? Uh, they better hope it's some room for him to come back. That's where I'm at. Mm. Uh, what what mm. Deion say? Uh, the the oh, luggage is coming with me. So, um, you know, if, if it's a spot, you know, congrats. If not, sorry, guys, we on the bigger and better things. Yeah, I'm 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 with Cindy now with the blonde hair. <laughs> don't say, don't say I'm with Judy baby. with the big booty now. Mm. <laughs> Od, what what say you? Uh, I'm gonna read my super chats before I get to me. All right, let me read them jumps. Uh, Zach Fletcher, thank you for supporting the channel, man. He says, after seeing UK 24 class, bring me Cal. Yeah. Mm. Hey, Philip Frame, flex on him. <laughs> According to multiple sources, Arkansas is ex- expected to reach a deal with Kentucky. Head coach John Calipari to be the next head coach of the Razorbacks. Mm. Arkansas finally has their guy. Mm. Hey, man. Thank you for supporting the channel, man. We appreciate you. Yeah, that's what we're actually talking about right now, man. So jumping back over here. So the question on the table was, read it, tell me again. Uh, the, the question was, having uh, how do you feel about having Coach Cal have a blank slate with only – no one on the roster really. Only person they got under under scholarship is is Brazil. So he's he's pretty much has a blank slate at this point. How you feeling about that? Did Kentucky have a better point guard than us? Yes. How about shooting guard? Yes. How about small forward? Yeah. Yes. Yes. How about power forward? Yes. How about center? You already mm-hmm. know the answer to that. You may have one of these. Hey, one. all a. All them dudes, hey man, I catch you down at Tyson in a, in a, in a Tyson <laughs> chicken plant. Hey, holla! At this point, yeah. I don't care. They all gone. He can have a clean slate. Hey, <laughs> you want with me shooting in the gym? Guess what? You were, Y'all the bum squad. The <laughs> we out of here. We don't care about that no more. <laughs> Let Cal have a clean slate and bring all them jokers and bring whoever he want to bring in here. I don't want to see none of them dudes. The only one who ain't went pro, Trevor Brazil. Hey man, we complained about that dude, but he ain't went nowhere yet right now. He may just be a hog. And if he, he ain't going nowhere, let he him be. stay. He the only one ain't jump shit right now. Let him stay. Yeah. Yeah. That's how I feel. Yeah, about we don't want the bomb back. squad. All of them that left. Joseph Pena. No. Uh, uh, who else? Tremont, he Mark, you. Battle. I promise you, he didn't want Joseph Pena. His college shit was over <laughs> yeah. with. His Blocker, was over with. I don't care. Y'all all the bomb uh, squad now. Y'all ain't here. Y'all yeah. left. Y'all left too Listen. early. Y'all jumped ship. Nope. Y'all should have just yep. sat back and wait. Patience is a virtue. Hey, yep. I could have been now playing out here the like, coach. Dang, Kansas. man. You think hey, that, now they be like, hey, man, do you think – you think uh you think Coach Cal uh, uh uh take me back if I ask him? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, you can you can take them dudes on the end of the bench that didn't leave the walk ons. You can have a spot, but you got you ain't get no scholarship. Uh, them dudes that come in the, in the game and shoot the last uh twelve shots when they up by forty, you can come in the game now. You can be on that end of the bench because that's where you relegated on the Coach Cal team. Well, that's greasy. I think Blocker mm. could come back though. And he might. So, hey, Melo. Hey, Melo, yeah, did you hear the question? You want to answer that question? Uh, my bad. I'm muted him. I'm sorry. Yeah, Hold had on, you muted. Did you have a lot going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Hey, I don't got too much to say. Forget out. Hey, only thing I'm going to say, I know one thing for sure, two things for certain. Devo, you gone, baby. You ain't coming back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sweet <thing>. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, you know what? Hey, you know what? I'm sorry, Melo, for everything I said because I ain't never heard you say that. <laughs> 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 Yeah. <laughs> no one ready for that. <laughs> yeah, he ro- he rolled out on his boy that time, didn't he? <laughs> he let the meanest shut out. He was the real quick. And then he bounced Ooh. on there. He he out. Yeah, he dropped the mic. <laughs>
Man. Lord have mercy. Shout out to you, Melo. Wow. Well, mm-hmm. this is a interesting it's... turn of events. All Hog fans, how do y'all feel? I mean, you it know? is. Amazing. Yeah, I, was, I mean, it's... I was I was hot under the collar before that. I was mm-hmm. yeah. Sick. Turning your drink job was on the line, in, bro, in a I, sense. His job was on the line. Just sick of getting made a fool of, bro. I'm talking about Drinkowitz got the big the co the cojones to put up, uh uh, what do they call them uh, on us billboards in Arkansas with Missouri all over the place, man. We can't lose a uh, we can't lose in basketball, bro. If we lose basketball, man, it's a wrap. What else we got? You know what I'm saying? Until well, we Pitt- Gucci. You know why we Gucci? We can't let Missouri talk about us. Missouri got a total of two championships in SEC or on all collegiate sports. We got 51. I ain't sweat Missouri. They they mm. they like little chihuahuas with a nice bite in football. That's it. And the event, that's going to mm. fade off fast enough, too. I, I don't look at them arrivals being forced, but the, I guess the proximity has made it that. Because I see they always talking junk. But you, I mean, you can't go 0-19 in the SEC and talk any trash. I'm sorry. If we was 0-19, I'd be buried my head in the sand. I don't even think y'all would have a podcast. <laughs> if we hey, was so I got a question. I got a question, right? Let's just say hypothetically that none of this is true. Who we blaming? Honey, you're a chick. Oh, Honey, you're a chick. Yeah, you're a chick burns on the stake. Oh, Ooh. yeah. He'll, I mean, this dude would be up on, I mean, crucifying. Crucifying. Yeah, I mean, they, like they would burn him. In him the 1600s. The- Mm-hmm. He hire if this don't fall through. If this don't fall through, the next guy will feel like Swiss cheese, Bruh. If man, if, we might as well hire Daryl Walker at that point. You, you gonna oh, have man. to, man, because I don't want the job yeah. now. Exactly. I don't want it. Like I y'all gotta think, think about it, bro. Ser- no, go ahead, Brock. I think it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Too many, too many news outlets. Like you said, Fox News. It's gonna happen. Them guys. Box been over there researching. Yeah, it's gonna Box, you've been over there researching, ain't you? Yeah. <laughs> you got quiet. I saw you looking down. You, you owe your sights. Man, well, I, I had feel to like. A couple te- I had to couple, test a couple people and get on my sights. It's going to happen. I mm. feel like this. With everybody's hope getting up, man, about the whole beard situation, bro, we we all felt like it. that, that was a done deal at some point. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And then when it didn't fall through, it went to Tang. We felt like Tang was a serious situation, but then that fell through. And then we all jumped on this car on this on this podcast tonight. This great group of gentlemen feeling like, damn, where where we where we going? Where is Arkansas basketball going? You know what I'm saying? G already had the inside scoop that we wasn't really privy to and really didn't I didn't believe that. You know, Calipari to Arkansas? Who but who believes that? But sure yeah. enough, Fox <laughs> team, bro. Fox 16, while I was on my soapbox about how how, how bad Hunter Year check is, it come Man. through California, Arkansas, bro. That's a well, huge you know, thing. Yeah, so I I mean, I, I'll walk it back if I said something about him. And I did. But what I said was true about, and I meant that. And then no matter if this goes through, fine, it's great. But if you as a, a AD with all this stuff that was happening and you knew that you were probably going to let your head coach was going to leave, I mean, that's what you get paid to do to get to always have them fillers out there. And guess what? All you gone, bet got somebody in the seat before it got cool. So now what's happening? And it's an upgrade. That's a that's a player move. And so, but if you if if you don't have that, then you really look like a sucker as an AD. So you ain't really got no juice when you go trying to find nobody because man, you didn't even you weren't even really. Re- you know, prepare for the blow that you knew that was coming. So yeah, that's how I felt about it. But he bossed up. So if this if this go through, hey man, for me, Hunter Yurichek wins. Uh, I mean, because he did bring in Must, and Must did lead the program in a better situation than where he found it. Now, uh, when it comes to the football side of it, yeah, he riding with uh, Sam Pittman, but he did bring Bobby Petrino back. He letting y'all know he willing to do some stuff. To get some stuff done, so that's that's that was a controversial hire. This right here is a big media hire. So man, the camp is gonna be buzzing. Everybody gonna be like, man, who he bringing in? Because all week long we've been looking at everybody jumping ship, jumping off the ship that they thought was listing. Now, man, you got a re- a real deal captain at the helm. Now what's happening? Now he got him a clean slate. So yeah, I mean, 
That's that's where I am. I'm 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 there with it, man. So I'm excited. Yeah, I'm 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 cool with it. I'm excited about it, man. Um, but I'm I do got a super excited. chat. I got to read. Give me one second, man, because I got to. What you say about super chat, man? <laughs> now you excited? I'm excited because it's, it's I mean, good I'm news excited. for Arkansas, oh, OD. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Reginald Cow says all you guys have to walk back your comments about our AD, right? Nah. Woo pig. Well, we, I mean, welcome, hey. Coach Cow. Hey man, we said what we said. That's what I mean. Yeah. That's how I felt stay. at the time. Yeah. Right, said it's an important not, hire. You couldn't screw up the hire, not, or his job would be on the not, line. Let's not get it twisted. Hey, bad little brother was on let, the right let's, side. Let's not let's not get it this <laughs> twisted. The Tysons told him to go get Calipari. It wasn't Hunter. Mm. Irregardless. Yeah, the irregardless, but yeah, Hunter is still. Hunter, but the Tysons put their feet down and told them to go get Calipari. Hey, the biggest donor in Arkansas. Calipari at first. Yeah, they, they. I mean, I guess that's the reason why they were saying the money this weekend when I was up there. They was like, "Look here, man, the money don't matter on this one." Hey, hey, seven minutes ago, CBS just dropped a a, a, a article. Man, they said sources told Norlander that the Tyson family. Arkansas's biggest donor is prepared to make a major commitment to land Calipari, who has been very yeah. close with the Tyson family for years. CBS is reporting this. Yeah, Matt Lernlander. Yeah, I'm on his Twitter. Yep. Yeah. yeah. That's real burn. And see, right. and, and see yeah. Kentucky already had to. The thing is, the reason why it's solidified is because he had to notify Kentucky yep. if he interviewed with any other job too. So. Yeah. Hey, this yep. this yep. what this what old Matt Hart said. He said roughly eight million per year, five from Tyson's, maybe others, fill in the rest of the deal. He will be the highest paid state employee, roughly six million in NIL money. Press conference Tuesday. Ooh. And he's going that, which means he's going to overtake Sam Pittman. Wait a Ooh. minute. When is the last time that the Arkansas Razorbacks have had a basketball head coach? Make more money than your head football coach. Ooh. Is that a commitment, folks? I mean, guys, is that a commitment? We want to know the Tysons. The Tysons is going to be taken care of a lot. Yeah. Well, we'll they, sure they, they got all this chicken. They got all this chicken money. They decide to use it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. The way y'all eating chicken around here. <laughs> Right. Can I, I can I ask everybody a question, but I got to address it to DZ first, though, because I think his opinion might be the most valuable in this question. DZ? Go ahead. We wait on yeah. you. Yeah, we wait on you, man. Would you take anybody that was on the previous team back for this team? Mm. Mm-mm. Only the one that's still there. The only one, yeah. All the rest of y'all for suckers left. Hey, bye. This is for ahead, DZ. DZ. <laughs> give me, give me Tremont Mark. Tremont Mark is the only door that I would leave open. That's it. If you're so Battle does not have a window. Nope. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying Battle was a scrub. He, I'm not saying that. But Calipari, could, he could bring some of those in. He could bring three battles in easy. Mm, tall Bye, Felicia. <laughs> 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 Okay. So, Hello. I mean, uh, anybody else like to talk, man? Come on, talk to me. What up? What up? What, what, what's your answer? How you feel? I, man, I, what's the question? I've been over here reading, man. What's the question again? My bad. <laughs> Is there anybody from the previous team that you would want to see back on the team for this year? Um, I, no. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be completely real with you. Not with the number two recruiting class sitting in the in the rafters. I, I mean. Mm. I, I'm on board with DZ as far as Tremont Mark because Tremont Mark was a dog and he was a pure shooter. He kept the team afloat all season long, regardless of what Musselman had going on. Tremont Mark came to shoot. He came to score. But other than that, mm. I mean, Brazil would be a close second. But, man, hey, if if Calipari is bringing the number two recruiting class to the Arkansas, Fed, to Fayetteville, Arkansas, bro, all them boys can sit at the house and look for another gig. I'm with, I'm with <laughs> oh, that. And one of y'all boys, y'all boys can sit at the crib. Box, what's that you? 
blocker marks in Brazil. Because you can bring all the five, you can bring them five five stars. You still got to have some vets around them. That's a good point, Box. Touche. Yeah, I say I say Mark uh, Brazil because I, I would like to see uh, Brazil's athleticism uh, be you know utilized in that Calipari uh, offensive set. So and he gonna be running. He run a, he runs an offense box. Do you agree? Yes. That's what so, I like. So he, he, it will be an offense. So. All right, I'm going to answer my own question. Y'all know why I want Brazil back? You know why I want Brazil back? Because one thing Coach Cal know how to do is coach big guys. Yep, that's facts. All right, check this out. For the, I feel like for the morale and the continuity of the team and for the energy, if we actually got blocker, battle, mark, and Brazil all to come back, I believe the energy towards the team for next season with all the other pieces coming in will be at his optimal peak. I'll take that. Mm. At worst, that's a sweet I 16 don't know if blocker. I don't know if blocker will be able to hang with the talent coming in. He'd be right back on the bench. I mean, defense, listen, defense it's, travels. It's all about, it's defense. all about competition. De it's about competition, yeah, right? Yeah. Defense travels regardless of where you go. Man, and I promise you, blocker, blocker on ball defense is better than anybody on Kentucky on ball defense. Yeah, can I tell you something? Position. Can I share something with y'all? What I feel like, but just if we talk about blocker, the one thing about blocker that hurt him this year, he was handcuffed. If you handcuff you when you go out, you ain't gonna be like just fluent. You're gonna be hesitant. That was part of the problem with a lot of the players this year. Herky jerky, you know, not giving them a chance to play through the game. Mm -hmm. That's the thing Cal Pellery is the king of. He'll let you play through all of it. Mm, Come man, on now. He can, he can play at A-State because we we own to the big and better, <laughs> man. We ain't trying to hear that. We ain't trying to hear that, to say, man. We try to get some new nicknames in the building. We, we want all so new nicknames. Bro, so I am not trying Rodrigo to see nobody not. we had on that 14 and 10, 22 <laughs> squad we had. It was 16 and 17, sir. Rondo, well, Demi, Rondo, they, Rondo. they can all be gone. The only person yeah, I want on that team is who's still there. If you gone Rondo, already, be gone. Rondo Martin was not just left today. He, he can't take wait, it back. Be gone. Wait, wait a minute. Rondo was not an offensive player until he till he got to the NBA. Rondo still he was wasn't an offensive specialist. player. What you hey, man, he was that was 20 years ago, bro. That was 20 years ago. <laughs> I, you ain't got no offense now. You you might as well just be Avery Johnson out here, bro. So, it's a wrap. Mm. What about he said he's done with the nineties. Hey, basically, <laughs> we done hey, with the nineties. What about Anthony hey, Black? Uh, that wasn't the nineties. Hey, Anthony Black actually mm. has gotten a little bit better in the league. Yeah, when it comes he to shooting, like thirty four percent from three. Thirty five. Say yeah. though. He, but Anthony Black was six seven point guard who could. Who could play great defense? Yeah, he got burned a couple times, but he can play really good defense. He can run the court, and and at six seven, all he needed was somebody who could hone his skills. And you know, Musselman can do it. Mm. Now he mm. in the NBA playing ball full time. He he, hey, he he practicing on his craft. Anthony Black gonna be all right. Bros, can I run some stats by y'all real quick, man? man run them. Calipari compiled a four hundred and ten. And 122 record. He had the number one overall recruiting class in 2023 and currently has the number two in the country behind Duke, bro. Th those are numbers and stats to be excited about, bro, if you're an Arkansas Razorback fan and this goes through. Because if if you can consistently – the man is 300, 300 games above 500, bro. You know what I'm saying? Then he, he consistently the the number one recruiting class and the number two recruiting class every single year, bro. Can you imagine the the pandemonium on the hill for basketball it's season? Gonna, can, it's you, gonna be gonna, sick. Uh, Walton, bro, it's gonna be a movie. It's gonna get crazy. Yeah. How many times ESPN game they gonna show up? Hmm? 
<laughs> they're gonna be up there. No longer the redhead stepchild. We just gotta go out there and execute and win games. And I think we'll be in position for it because the highlight, the lights will be very bright. DZ, you can go and act a fool now if you want to. Can y'all imagine not having the battle refs no more? <laughs> hey, can you imagine your hey, I bet you John Kyler Perry ain't gonna never be uh out of that suit and he ain't gonna take his shirt off. <laughs> he ain't gonna do that. Hey, recruits right here, y'all. It includes five star center Jaden Quaintance, four star guard Boogie Fland. Hey, he already got a cold name, Boogie. We don't, we, hey, you ain't even got to give him a nickname. Oh, name. man. <laughs> Four-star center, Thumbtoe Cyril. Four-star guard, Travis Perry. Four-star guard, Billy Richmond. And four-star forward, Carter Knox. Dang. Yeah. Yeah. He got, <laughs> dang, he got two centers, bro. Two centers. So two how many of those guys are going to come with him? Bro, I, I can guarantee you all of them. They ain't got a reason not to. What what do they have to lose? It ain't like yeah. Arkansas it, ain't known to send cats to the league at this point. Right. Yeah. We had three, yeah. four NBA players last year. Right. They ain't got nothing to lose. Can you and put up Coach a new Cal. Oh, yeah. What's the uh, new call? How excited would you be with John Calipari, John Calipari as your coach? Well, the, the poll that was up there, uh, uh, Calipari only got like what thirty five percent at the first of the show. Yeah, but guess who was one of those thirty seven percent? Me. Yeah. <laughs> if you got me to get a choice between Will Wade and Calipari, I'm gonna choose Calipari every time. What are you talking about? I'm just gonna keep it, it real. Four, uh, they had four hundred. It was out of four hundred votes. Uh, who do you want to coach? It was Will Wade, fifty one percent. Chris Sainz, three uh, percent. Daryl Walker, nine percent. And uh, Coach Cal was 37%. You want to know why his percent yeah. was lower, though? Because people didn't think it was real. People were like, yeah, right, that Bro, ain't even real. I wish, you, you, know, I, you know, that, that's the times, oh, I wish we would have done a show, because I think we would have talked about that. That What's little that? GM we got dropped. Who got, what? We, I said, I, that's the time I wish we would have did our show on Saturday. Because if, man, that would have been a heck of a GM for us to drop. Nobody would have believed it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, but if they all they got to do is just go back and look at the at, at this show, and you see, I, we was already talking about it before it even facts. came on the show. We was yeah, out here. Facts. I mean, I'm sitting here saying, did we interview Cal? Yeah, we facts. put it out there. Uh, hey, unbiased. I can't drop that poll because I'm trying to Don't go in as a regular person. Like, but it don't show me my live stream. So. Oh. Yeah, don't actually, I could get to it. Tape on these boys. I can't wait to start watching these boys tape. I can't even mm. lie. I'm yeah. Y'all go check, I, I mean, go check the Hog Wild podcast out, man. Mo on. doing all the breakdowns on video. Y'all go show him some love, man. Yeah, y'all go Mo, show him. you saying you upset you ain't got to do love. all the Cohen film? You ain't got to watch Cohen film? <laughs> nah, and the thing I like about uh, watching film on these boys, I like to see what type of players we get and what players we got. What skill set do they bring to the table that somebody else ain't got? You know what I'm saying? In comparison to what we had last year. Like, it'll be easy to watch film on these cats, especially at center, to compare him to Twinkle Toes. I'm, I'm ready to see what he got. Hold on, don't you dog know? out Twinkle Toes. He balled out <laughs> at the end of the year. Give I'm just saying, bro. I'm just saying, <laughs> man. I'm going to read my super chats, man. Boss Hall, appreciate you for always supporting the channel, man. He says, G. Holmes, are you surprised? I wouldn't pay... Pittman, five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, that's real. See love all the way from out there in LA. He says, I'm not getting my hopes up until he signs on the dotted line. Hey. I said what Hey I man, said. we just hey, we just got real uh it just hit right now. Eleven. Eight million 10, 11. a year. Oh, eight million eight a year. Million, what I said eight point five. I was short by I was over yeah. by five. I said eight point five. Yeah, it exactly. is now it is. If your nope. check pulls this off, he can repost the bus video. Oh, he's Seventeen times. driving. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it so just hit. Y'all saying it's official tissue, huh? It's official tissue, bro. Ooh, let me check. You know, I be in do not disturb mode, so I don't even be getting my. Yeah, man. Well, you better it's be disturbed now. 
I can't. <laughs> hey, I do. I'm, I'm over here now, Coach Cal, baby. Uh, look at it's look at. Oh, he deal. excited now. Hey, box, you hear? <laughs> I'm happy we got a coach, bro. Cause I'm sitting here like, yo, we need some, we need some, we need a coach. Yeah, but you was acting up. I said, what if Cal? Cause I told, I, I already heard the mumbling, so I came in. I said, well, what if Cal's our coach? And you, I asked y'all the question. You was like, rah, 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 rah. and now look hey. at you. Look, hey, DB, man, I look, we, we hired Thanos, man. We hired Thanos, bro. So we hired Thanos, and we gave Thanos eight million dollars a year. Yeah. Now what? Uh, so we better hope that don't nothing come back in, have, in, in recruiting violations and then we get stuck like Chuck out here. Hey, man. Here we go with that again. I'm bro. just saying. I'm just saying. I mean, uh, dang. Come on, man. Listen, don't you be you being worse than Box on the on the pessimism right now. You is tripping, tripping. Yeah, I'm just yay. Uh, y'all Hey, baby, I'm just saying a zebra don't change your stripes, baby. I just told the I told the whole fan base, please take a deep breath. Don't let the PTSD kick in. Just you know, just chill. Don't worry about the rumors. Just let it come out. It's gonna come. And I think we can actually say that we're very satisfied. I think the fan base yeah. will be happy about this. And I think Kentucky's gonna oh, be yeah. happy about that, being able to move forward and do something different too. I, I yeah. think I think this is good for all parties. I think yeah. great for us for short term, great for Kentucky long term. Because I don't think I think at that point they were separating. You know, so. Yo. We need 15 more people to hit that like button, man, in the in the YouTube. Uh, just zero down it, uh, close the chat out, man, hit the like button. We need 15 more of you guys to hit the like button for us. And don't forget, man, uh, next week on, I mean, yeah, next week on Friday, we all going to be up on the hill. Uh, we're going to Friday night, man, we're going to be over at uh, Walk-Ons at uh, 1199 North Shallow, uh, they're in Fayetteville, Arkansas, right off of Weddington. Uh, start at 6.30. We're going to be there out there all off the patio. So, man, come one, come all. Uh, we're going to be up there to see the spring game, man. It's going to be a lot of buzz on the hill this week uh, because of this new coaching hire. So, man, the Whoopig Podcast, we're going to be in the mix. So, y'all come on up there. Uh, myself, OD, uh, DZ, Coach Box. Um, I think some of our sponsors are going to come up there, too. Uh, so we're going to be kicking it, man. But don't forget, at Walk-Ons at 6.30 at 11.99 uh, North Shallow, right there off of Weddington. Come out, kick it with your boys. <laughs> Mo Lester hey, funny. Mo, Mo, Lester, Mo Lester Jr. came in here, and he, he said, we get, he said, wow, we got washed up cow. <laughs> Shots fired. Well, let's see how it works out. I mean, listen, if he gets us to a final four, let's say he doesn't win a championship, but he takes us to his final four and he's here for five years, would you be uh, happy with that or upset? It's a win. Yeah. It's a win. One thing for sure, and one thing's for certain Arkansas Razorback basketball is going to have eyeballs on it. And from everywhere. Yes, sir. Yeah. Everywhere. It's, it's, I mean, it's. The, the popularity of what we thought Musk was just went way up just because of who he is. That's that's probably the most high-profile coach that's been on the hill since Nolan or Bobby Petrino. They say he in to be real. Bill they that, say that, I mean, they had, a, they had a buzz around them. You know what I mean? I mean? We've had good coaches, but when the last time you had a coach that had buzz where the media room going to be back packed? You know, it's that that's that's the Calipari brings that. Everybody gonna wanna know. Everybody in Arkansas right now is gonna wanna get that first interview with Coach Cal. Everybody's gonna wanna be ask, answering you know, asking him those questions. So yeah, it's gonna change. And guess who's gonna be put some of them folks? The Woo Pig Podcast, cause we ain't stopping. Mm. Yes. Oh. Hey, hey, mm. how many of y'all knew who Eric Musselman was before he got hired at Arkansas? I did. I did. I mean, I, 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 I knew his dad. Know who he was. I did. I knew about him ever since Golden State. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I watched him, at, you know, as, I know as a coach. I knew about his dad, too. The whole history. Now, I'm a basketball head. Everybody know who Calipari is, though, bro. You hear the mm -hmm. name and you that is. And let's, let's talk about this whole washed up thing everybody want to talk about. If you spend 15 years. These are you time, mad. You low. Hey, leave him alone, Odeco. Last time you got him on his mic, he has got off. 
<laughs> no, I'm just saying he low. He's just his game. <laughs> he's ass. He's got his like game volume one and two. Go down. I don't know there what go. to do at this point. Like, <laughs> there you go. Yeah, it, it's good. I didn't even touch. Yeah, but anyways, about this notion of him being washed up, man. When you work somewhere for 15 years, what's the one way to get some love in yourself again? To relocate. That's how you re-spark yourself. So we don't know what we about to get. This man, hey, think about the businesses that's about to boom just by him being here. Like, man, this finna change our entire state. This is, I don't think people even realize the magnitude of this. This is crazy. He, he might be more motivated than ever. In the uh, famous words of our former coach, Eric Musselman, he might be more motivated than ever, bro. <laughs> you know what mm. I'm saying? Facts. Do you do you think Coach Cal will wear a uh, Razorback hoodie? I don't think so. No. I ain't he'll never wear, seen him dressed like that. He'll wear a Razorback Italian suit before he do that. Yeah, mm -hmm. he. Yeah, it's old way for seeing him in them things. Uh, coaches, y'all better get y'all some I suits. I done seen him in um those uh collar things. What's the name of them things? Yeah, uh, I don't know. Talking about a uh, like a sweater, like a. Well, it ain't a sweater. It's like a jacket, the zip up jacket, jacket type thing, uh, like the uh, windbreaker like thing. I done seen jacket. one of them. Yeah, as we had the windbreakers. How about this? This is a forward thinking question. With John Palacar, yeah. John Calipari at the helm at Arkansas, what would be considered an acceptable season in his first year? Win the SEC. That's the only so is it, win the SEC or bust? Nah, nah. I just I just said something to see what everybody else is gonna say. I'm gonna be all the way real with you. I just wanted to see everybody nice. react. Somebody I on Twitter we're... just added me and said, I'm so happy I'm about to go to Insurance Max. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say this. I think a top, a top four SEC finish with a 23 plus one season would be a successful season for. for what what you say? A top four finish in the SEC with a 23 win season would be considered a successful season for Calipari. Hey man, at eight million dollars a year, bro. We better be champions. We better be yeah. champions. I'm not trying to hear that top four crap. Yeah. No. Now we're two recruiting class in the country, bro. No, that that's unacceptable. <laughs> yeah. I'm a, okay. Yeah, that's, I'm just. I'm, I'm getting the gate to what your standards are for him in, in his first year. I first year, say. SEC championship. At least if he ain't the champion, you got to be at least number two. At least yeah. bare, bare minimum. Yeah. Most hey. Days. Okay. Hey, o OD, I got something for you. Hold on just a second. On the on the hotline, man, they don't call me in. Uh, OD, one of our sources, uh, he, he talked to last night, and uh, they really broke the Calipari news to me and OD, and uh, they made a little wager. And so he's he's on the phone. Give it up for Mr. The Hall of Famer, B-I-Z, man. B-I-Z, what's up, baby? Talk to us. What's going on? What's going on, guys? Uh, OD, can you hear me? Yeah, I hear you, man. We hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. So uh, that'll be a fake medium well. <laughs> and uh, let me see if I can get the Cajun pasta on the side. <laughs> yeah. And since I can't talk about the alcohol every time I drink, go ahead and make that a, a water with extra lemon. And, I, and I'll tell you about my drink later at the bar. Now, did I make this bet? I don't remember making this bet. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, yeah. I, that I was last night, telling, bro. I remember someone telling me that they didn't like. And the other one need a certain type of alcoholic beverage. <laughs> I, I, I don't remember, I don't remember, remember this bit, man. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't recall me was, saying anything of the sort. All I said was that there's that before Monday, you're going to hear Cal, uh, Calipari's name in the conversation before Monday. I got about an hour and a half before before midnight, before Monday. <laughs> and here's man now in the conversation. Again, that's a medium well. <laughs> you can get the baked potato on the side with the pasta salad. Well, mm. hey, I was there, man. I think, as I said before, I, 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 I don't think know. Y'all got, 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 got me on tape. Y'all got me on tape still in boxes. I, just, okay. I don't really <laughs> say that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Biz, man, man. We, we, hey, bro, we appreciate you kicking it, man, coming, calling in, man, and, and getting your stuff together. Don't forget, Biz, we're going to be in the city. Uh, this weekend, man, we're gonna be over there at uh Walk Ons off of Weddington, starting at six thirty. You guys can come kick it with a Hall of Famer. 
right there. I would, I would definitely be right there. I would, Man. I would, I'd have to be right there because that's where my steak is going to be at. Oh. Uh, <laughs> would steak be ready? <laughs> my steak will be ready right there. Hey, <laughs> yo. Well, all right, there, brother. No, man, man, we will. Uh, hey, we'll... I appreciate everything, man. Go ahead. We'll, we'll no, I'm just. I mean, I was just thanking you for calling in, man. Just to let you know, man. We'll see you this oh, weekend. No problem, man. No problem. Man. All right, and see you guys this weekend, man. Good show, and uh, look forward to that steak meeting. Well, <laughs> all right, bro. We'll holler at you. <laughs> you got it. All right. Oh man, let me read my man. Shout read out to our homeboy, the B I Z. Man, Boss Hog says, man, people on Facebook is saying. They're only eating Tyson chicken now. Hey, man. I, I, I want to start looking for Tyson chicken, you heard? Oh, man. Hey, shout out to Great Bread, man. He got here supporting the channel. He says, does Coach Cal bring his number two recruiting class with him? Absolutely. Some of it. Some no, of it all of them. I'm, I'm going out on the limb, and I am predicting that probably all those players will come. Players That's commit great. to the school. I mean, school – Commit to the coach, not the school. And matter of fact, I think I said that on one of these right here. Players commit to the coach, not the school. That's what yes. I said. Hey That's man, what I said. West out here, West out here in these Twitter streets, man. Everything happening out here. It's going down. <laughs> I only put that. It's on, going, only put one post. Man, said, if I woke up in the morning and, and, and Calipari was my coach, I wouldn't be mad. Yeah, yeah. Just, they they, they get it in. I just seen that Calipari already done flipped them. Talk to the recruits about flipping Arkansas. Yeah, yeah it's oh, going, it's going down. Here. The Kentucky Network is saying, face. "I'm told recruits who are currently committed to Kentucky have been contacted <laughs> about flipping to Arkansas." <laughs> yeah. Deezy, go and go and do your dance, bro. Go and get it in. You heard? <laughs> I'm about to go spend my life savings on season tickets. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't hey, do don't that. do that, bro. We're gonna be getting in for free, bro. They, they ain't gonna <laughs> hold us off, man. We the Woo Pig Podcast, baby. Hey, we we gonna be hey, in the James. press boxes up here, baby. Oh. We coming up. DZ, D, I know DZ. DZ finna act up now. Hey, uh, <laughs> what time do the club close? Ain't no club in Fairview. <laughs> you that's know a lie. Uh, uh, that, that, party. that is a lie. <laughs> yes. Hey, old smiles outdoors says ESPN just reported, just reported it. Yep. Hey, that's this new. Is done it's done hey. Um, that's the first thing to pop up. Sources: Calipari found it with Arkansas. Yeah. Hey man, that's cool. That's crazy. Can, so, can y'all believe that the Arkansas in. Razorbacks and put them and put a mu- put a monkey a out there, man? They put Bro, a boss the move. Big, it's the biggest. This the biggest move for Arkansas sports in ten years. They ain't pull a rabbit out their head. They pulled a monkey out their head. Ooh. I think longer than 10. Bruh. Five year yeah. deal, eight million a year. Mm. Yeah. 40, 40 million, bro. Yeah, bro. Mel- hey, listen, Mel- everybody, Mel- you go tonight, to your neighborhood man. store and get Tyson chicken every time you get your chicken. You yeah, get the bad man. Somebody, the somebody got That's going to be your NIL food. right there. That's your NIL payment. <laughs> nah, bro. If they went, I'm telling you, this right here. Guess what? If he talked to them Tyson's and he he close to with them like that, you know what he told them? Look here, man. Uh, this is what I'll do it for. But this is what I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need y'all to reach down in in your in your bags because I'm gonna bring some players in here. But we are gonna have to make it right. Yep. Another chat. Another super chat from Boss Hog. ESPN just just said it's a five year deal. Mm. Yep. Hey, mm-hmm. we out here, baby. We out here. We so out here, Mark, bro. We gonna fight about this. We gonna fight about this. Are you gonna? You gonna? Are you? Are you? Are you bowing down? He done. Are you finished? or Are I you thought, done? Uh, My quad thought, right now. I thought. Y'all. I thought we talked about that earlier. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. I just want to know if you bowing down or you gonna well, keep on fighting on this. Well, this would. I thought we talked about that earlier. See, one thing that I know about y'all, when when y'all just want to talk, y'all just talk. Y'all don't listen. Because what I said earlier, I, I'm I said just because I said just because me and OD don't like don't don't like Kayla don't mean we ain't gonna support him at Arkansas. I said right. that an hour ago. All right, boy, I'm gonna see how you act during <laughs> the season. I'm gonna that, see how hey, you act during hey, the hey, season. Wait, wait a minute. But <laughs> hey, you know how I'm gonna act? I'm gonna act the same way I always act because I'm a Razorback fan. Mm-hmm. Mm. Above That's how I'm at. That's real. 
Next on, sure. next on the on the list is, hey, we bring it in. That uh that coach that used to coach the uh University of Alabama man gonna take Sam Pittman job. What you talking about? <laughs> Nick Saban. Nick Saban, Saban man. Back. We about to go it's holler at Nick Saban Nick's now. <laughs> bro, hey, if they bring Saban to Arkansas, bro. I might Bobby Petrino, that. Bobby Petrino got to go then. Hey, now that that's that, that's too many. That's nah. too much. To let's keep the let's keep Bobby in the building, baby. Let's keep Bobby in yeah. the building. That ain't happening. Save him, come no. Mm-mm. But do well, y'all want to know? Do y'all realize what this does for Arkansas basketball long term? No. To oh, follow yeah. uh, follow Muss up with Calipari, bro. You got to be a goat to come Arkan to come coach at Arkansas after this. You gotta be an all-time coach. What's mm. going on, son? Well, the the dominoes have failed, and in my prediction right now, we got Cal Beer going to Kentucky, Will Wade going to Ole Miss. Wow, they're gonna shake it up. The That's what's about to happen. Falling. That's what's about to happen, well, man. What I wish happened, I wish we get rid of Arkansas women basketball coach. We got Cal. And just go go ahead and fire Pittman after six games and give it to Petrino, then we'll be set. Hey, hey well, I'm we say this, one out of six if, games though. If Pittman yeah. fixed that O line, hey, he he cool with me. I ain't gonna lie. If that O line is is amazing this year, I ain't I ain't gonna be on that Pittman train. Yeah. I think Pittman can be a Les Miles. Les Miles wasn't wasn't the greatest coach, but he knew how to get great assistance to make him look good. He He won one, so I'll take that in a heartbeat. Hey, that's crazy how we was ready to fire your check. Now I almost want to build him a statue. Go ahead, get the fun started. <laughs> yeah. Well, you I'm know he you. did hire Kelvin Sampson to Houston too. You know, so I mean, he got a he got a good basketball coach uh, hiring track record. Hey, Jeff Jeff Goodman just said been told that uh by one source that Calipari will have access to an NIL package that will rank among the best in the in college basketball, excess of five million dollars per year. That means they didn't invest thirteen million dollars a year, Tyson. No, they, listen, everybody go get your chicken now. <laughs> what? <laughs> but the, you but boys the, about to get laid off at Tyson yeah, Chicken, man. Chicken about to go through the roof right now. <laughs> <laughs> and a dollar Bruh. to every package. Everybody going to be hey, eating I'm chicken legs to... and chicken thighs now because you can't afford the breast no more. Tyson's hey. breast about to be a billion dollars. I went grocery shopping and the breast was $2 eggs. more. <laughs> hey, my donation is chicken with chicken wings and, and chicken Facts. legs, baby. Yeah, I eat that. Maybe during the Final Four Arkansas plan. How about that? Mm. So do you it, think that it's the reason we kept Pittman in football is because we really didn't have a coach that they wanted? No, they didn't want to, to get replace. that $16 million. That's a fact. They, and they was only going to do it for Gus Malzahn. So y'all hey, think still, they still to get Gus. It ain't too late. Next year, we still can get him. Well, is Tyson the people that's behind Gus? I don't know who Tyson I don't know if Tyson's football invested. So, I mean, I don't know the background on that. So. I don't yeah, know, but sure. they got they got set that chicken money is different. <laughs> <laughs> chicken, chicken, that chicken money, that chicken, chicken money. What you mean? Don't forget about the hunt money. They'll come back now. Yeah, oh, Ooh, the hunt money coming back. That's yeah, real. the hunt money coming back. I saw a JB Hunt about truck. To get nasty. Alice today. Mm. Hey, DZ, look at me, King. I know you want to dance. <laughs> dance again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go again. He's been a stun on him. He's been a stun on him all year. <laughs> hey, when you finally get you, you you might finally get to see the program be a winning program. Mm. What are you talking about? Oh, we want to I had to, to fight. I mean, I'm just saying, I mean, hopefully they cuz our like box says, now you can make this great hire. Are you now are you satisfied with the Sweet 16? Are you satisfied with an Elite Eight? I mean, no, you're, you're not. No, I'm, uh, that, that's what they – okay, so – because that's the pedigree that Coach Cal comes with, right? Whether or not he won a bunch of them, doggone it, he was in some some fights for it. 
And so guess what? Now that's what we're going to expect. Like Box said, now I mean I got to be on, on on Box team. He said, "Man, are, are, as a program, are you satisfied with Elite Eights?" So, and he was like, "Well, yeah, but y'all saying that's successful. It ain't gonna be successful for us, for Coach Cal, because you're like, oh dang, the only thing we did was make it to this, and you know, it's just like Kentucky. They they are used to Final Four appearances, not necessarily the championship, but Final Four appearances." Every couple, uh, you know, every you know, four or five years. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? What's that comment right there? <laughs> hey, Khalif, Khalif Battle just posted this on his Twitter. What did he say? You see it? Well, then. That's well, all he said. Yep. <laughs> well, well, yo, you shouldn't. Have, well, you shouldn't have left. Up. He shouldn't have left. He just left. No, he just left. He shouldn't have left. Minutes ago. Four minutes huh? ago, he really, he really tweeted that. Yeah, <laughs> he said he needs some nil, man. Don't 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 count him. But out. that's what. But see, and you know, they probably are thinking, God, dog, I couldn't have just waited. Yeah, but it doesn't matter though, because the cow's gonna do what he want to do anyway, whether you you transfer or, or not. It's simple paperwork for that. So. Yeah, yeah, we don't want you no more. Your contract is up. <laughs> <laughs> y'all playing dirty, yeah. man. Y'all get a little upper hand. Y'all act a fool up in here. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, but that's the truth. Hey, Your contract is over with. Old Smile Outdoor says Tyson sells pork and beef too. Woo, pig suey. <laughs> hey, man, they sell it all. You can get whatever you want to in a Tyson. That hey, would be good. I, I got one question, though, man. I got one question to ask y'all. Where are all the Missouri Tiger fans at now? I bet Where you they, they quiet as them person mouths. Boy, who they coaching? I think again? I might troll them for the first time ever. I might go troll right. them for the first time ever. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Cause I don't be no Them boys about to be. <laughs> boys about to be back out here, man. <laughs> hey, man, it's about to be a good basketball season next year, man. I, I can just feel it. Just Very the buzz intriguing. of the basketball Whoa. season. It's gonna be fire. The buzz is gonna Hold be off. Hold on, stop the press. Very stop intriguing. the press. We want Bron to. No, we don't. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Stop the press, Sam Jones. <laughs> No, nah, we don't. Hey, no, nah, we, we do not, not want him. No, no, we good. We good, Sam. Hey. We good, Sam. Hey. No, heck no. You, you Why we want that for? Crazy. Hey. I'll take you money trade. over the you, you might not want Bronny, but Bronny, but DeBron James and Calipari is real, real tight. Man, I don't care who he tight. Uh, I don't care who he tight. Hey, man. I don't want to see Bronny James. I don't want Bronny. Big trash, bro. I can tell y'all right now, if John Pro, if, if he bring Bronny in here to to Arkansas, our podcast is a blow up because we gonna be roasting him. When I tell you, we don't care who you are. Look at we just gonna face. tell you the truth about your game. So if you really want Bro. some critiques, bring Bronny to to the University of Arkansas. I promise hey, he do, you. He does not want that smoke, bro. I'm he telling don't want you. that smoke. We, we don't. We don't because we don't care nothing about who your daddy is. Bro, that boy, we don't care nothing about that. Boy, that, talk to that, dude right got, that dude is not a bad player like y'all sitting here trying to act yeah. like Bro, hey, thank you. Thank you. He Are y'all crazy? Y'all tripping, bro. He you can y'all watch any Bronny James games this year? You big Do y'all know who USC coach, coach was? I don't did, care who he was. Did you watch Bronny the games? Coach Cal? Are did you y'all watch crazy? Any, did you watch him play? The dude yes. just came back from cardiac arrest. What you want to Thank you. Hey, he can go get arrested with cardiac because the boy can't play. Bro, y'all, bro, y'all bro. crazy. Oh, my God. Man. Y'all say y'all wanted the press? Get Brunna James. You got Cal and him. You getting all the press you want. Man, bro, I, I want wins. I want to win. I don't care years. about no, yeah. no Brunna James. It. He is not good, bro. To me, he ain't that He ain't that player. He is not that player. I like his brother Bryce more than him. Yeah. I like him too. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I really like Bryce. So, Nah. Mm, hey I'm y'all, like, forgive my people tonight. They done had a couple of takes that's just crazy. They don't they don't mean that. Forget yeah, it. Yeah, we mean it. You know I, I mean, mean it. it. I mean I, it. I mean it. I mean it. Hey, y'all hear what Trey Biddy said uh John Calipari's son, Brad Calipari, to join the staff at Arkansas when he get when the y'all everything gets finalized. On the court mm. player development at Vandy. Mm. Ooh, I like mm. that. He was at mm. Vandy? You know we like. Hey, just imagine if we get Vandy point guard and that big dude. Hey, Ooh, we cooking that, with that, fist grease, baby. <laughs> we cooking with fist grease. Y'all boys ain't talking about nothing. If we get them boys with Vandy. 
Hey, Woo! man, that'd be cold, right? And, and we get the boys that Coach Gal got coming in. Bro, it's championship or <laughs> bus. I don't care what y'all <laughs> fools talk about. And Brother Jay can kick rocks. I'm sorry, cuz. Brody J, my cuz says Brody has game, bro. Mm-hmm. Right, cuz. Brody ain't got no game. He got game at, 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 uh, under the bridge, under, at, uh, uh, down on Canis. He ain't got, yeah. no, he ain't got no game at, 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 at this level. Man, boy, that's super trash, man. He's super trash. Hit the super trash super one for me, G. Trash. <laughs> no, no. Brody, hey, if you li- hey, Brody, you going to find this. You going to listen because you finna be a fan of us real soon. Come no, on, no. dog. We taking you in. We taking not- you in. Don't listen to them. They they hard yeah, to win man. over, but once you win them over, they they there for life. Man, you gotta come in and average twenty points. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me read my what? super chats. Who we got? Uh, Danny Burns. Thank you for supporting the channel, man. He says want to hear Cal call those hogs. Ooh, that's gonna be different Ooh. right there. <laughs> yes, sir. That's he gonna hit different. Tomorrow, three o'clock, three p.m. He'll be calling the hogs tomorrow, three p.m. Uh oh, you heard it here, box head. Three o'clock. They had hey. a national championship game. Ooh. Brandon Bro, Bailey ball. says, put some respect on Hunter Yurichek name. Man. First Petrino, now Calipari. Man, he's swinging he swing for the fence. For the fr- hey, hey, woo wee. That's an A. I, Bro, appreciate up. you supporting the channel, man. Yeah, bro, it's going down. <laughs> yeah, it's going down. Yeah. I'm kind of hype, man. I ain't going to lie to you, dog. I'm kind of getting hype right now. Uh-huh. Hey, y'all yeah, see how man. quick stuff, <laughs> though? Hey, man. Hey, man I, I don't want no. just thinking about the possibilities, I no, I want, bro. I don't want no Calipari. I don't want him. Yeah, somebody, somebody make a highlight reel at the beginning yeah, of the show. The on how how OD, OD is just like me, a hog fan. Yes. What yeah. part of that don't everybody understand? Yeah. <laughs> so how you feeling, Box, as, as it's sinking in? I mean, I don't hate Calipari. I just don't like him. It's a difference. <laughs> it's a difference. Now, since, hey, but but since he's here, I'm I'm cool with that because he can he 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 can coach offense, and he he brings legitimate big man to the game, something yeah. that we ain't had since Big Nasty. That's what. That's exactly what was about to come out of my mouth, G. Since since yeah. Corliss, we ain't had not a nan. Hey, what yeah. was Box saying? He ain't won nothing. He only won <laughs> one chip. He ain't won nothing. Man. <laughs> hey, out of third, out of thirteen years, I ain't good percentage, Daisy. What, bro? Oh, I, one championship in a career is a great career. What are you talking about, Box? Bro, when, when, when Nolan you, got when one. Got top, wait a minute. When you got when you got consistent. Number one, number two, number three recruiting classes, that's not a good percentage, bro. Come on. I think now, that's, that's looking is, at Cal it crazy. Cal is a good coach, but one <laughs> championship out of all them years is not a good percentage out of all the, all the teams in the head. Yeah, that is hey, true. Box, you're not even hey. a percentage guy. You hey, are, man, Box is just tester. a realist. He's a realist, hey. man. You're a good coach, hey. but you know what? You had a terrible percentage when it comes to getting them chips. But you know bro, what about Danny, Danny, Hur- Danny Hurley done one, too. Hey. The thing about Nolan, he yeah, he got one. He got one with Arkansas. But the thing about Nolan's that he he got a he the only coach in basketball history with a a, a championship at every single level every of basketball. Every single level he got a he got a championship. That's what make that's what make Nolan so great. Yeah, I mean, I'm not I'm not trying to, you know, hold nothing off of him, but I'm just saying Hey, I got a super chat. Hold on. Got a super chat, man. Boss Hall. What up, Boss Hall? Boo has changed big time. <laughs> Ain't it mine? That's what I said. The tail hey, of two tails. I'm a like like Box said, man. I'm a Hall fan, man. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be happy with Coach Cal. Because guess what? They didn't hire anybody from the bum squad. Yeah, they you did. You don't remember who yeah. the bum squad is? Let me put that back up here for you. Let me, let me find the bum squad. So we, we ain't got nobody from that bum squad list. If it had been anybody from the bum squad list, then I would have been big mad. 
That's the bomb uh, squad. If we would hire any of these guys right here, Chris Jan, Sands, whatever the fool name is, or Daryl Walker, <laughs> that's the bomb squad. We don't want none of them. <laughs> we didn't get Damn. them. So I'm good. Bro, he hired above even what we thought we was going to get. I mean, I would have been happy with Will Wade. I ain't going to hold you. I mean, like I say, let's get one thing straight. They didn't. He didn't go out to Calipari first. He went out to Beard first. The mm-hmm. Tysons told him to go get Calipari. Mm-hmm. They told I'm him a, that. I believe that. And you know what? Everybody's saying that Beard was using Arkansas as a pawn. I, I think a lot of that might be true. But what Box just said might be the fact of the matter, bro. Yeah, Beard was our number one guy. But when they saw that Calipari was a real possibility, hey, hey, bro, like that's just like, oh, calling G. Man, hey, I got this job for you, bro. It's wide open. You know I'm going to give you exactly what you need if you come do this for you, boy, for five Just give me five years, G. You Man. know what I'm saying? Give me five yeah. years, so I got you. They trying to I go get you. off. They trying to go get these in box now, but I need you, G. I got G. you. I got exactly. you. I mean, you I know think, what I'm saying? Because hey, it, 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 that's that's money. We're talking about $5 million a year to a chicken company, man. You suckers going to eat uh, $5 million worth of chicken uh, before the show over with. So that's nothing to them. Yeah. That is small change. That's small That's small type change. So, yeah, man, I, I, I like Box said, they probably told him that. Yeah, and that's I, a think, fact. I think I don't even think they I told him. I think they went around him. I think they heard about Daryl Walker and they was like, hold on, let me put oh, y'all on oh, oh, real oh, quick. Oh, hell no, hell no. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not doing that. And lock and, and went ahead and locked Beard down just in case. You know what I'm saying? I think that's what I'm I'm glad you said that, Box, because it really brought a different perspective. You know what I'm you know, saying? They talk everybody talking about that eight million dollars and that five million, that five million for NIL. Colorado gave Dion $5 million. They didn't have no money. Look how much Bruh. they made last year just because of Dion. They're going to get that's, that money back and more. That's a very good point. That's a very good point. Hey, Dion did go to uh, Colorado without that $5 million, but he knew they was going to make it just off the strength of his name, and that's what, that's what happened. That's what happened. Man, it's gonna be this gonna be some real interesting times in in Fayetteville, bro. It's gonna be some interesting times on the hill. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's for sure. That is is, is Hunter don't your check the, the greatest team. AD of all time? No, I don't know. Not, I mean, of all time, I mean you can't discount Frank Bros. Right, but you can't do that. I mean, he he didn't take the you know to some to new time. levels, but man, he's. Hey, he he's doing better than Jeff Long. Bro. Jeff Long generated, if it, it, Je- Jeff Long did generate money. Kentucky he did. He, 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 but what Which I'm saying is, is can't touch him when it comes generate money. I don't know. This might this this right here may beg to differ. Maybe he maybe Hunter Yurchek actually went to them and said, "Hey, help us go get him. You guys, you got some connections and help us go get him. That's not just take for granted that he was told. Maybe he may, he got a connection with some folks up there. So maybe he went to them and said, look here, a muscleman gone. That might have been why he was talking so greasy, making them kind of things because he knew he had a heavy hitter in his back pocket with the no, Tyson he family. So he didn't hit, he you didn't don't know he that, bro. I, I mean, but bro, you're, you're, you that's finna, just, bro. but that's you just your finna, take you, box. You ain't That's finna just your take. get no tang if you got Musselman, if you got Calipari. Bro, but what I'm you saying is. Be, you ain't going to entertain them, them, them two bums he put on the screen if you got a Calipari. They told him to go do that. But you have to. But wait a minute. If you got an inside scoop, in order for you to not look just biased about this, no one else even has an opportunity yeah, let's go through the motions and let's let's talk to this guy. Let's talk to this guy. Already knowing what your what your real move is, but you kept everybody off of the radar. I'm telling you, everybody was off of the radar because his name didn't come up in nobody's search. And that night that I called OD with that, I'm telling you, no one else. I mean, it was on no news thing because we looked at it. So no, it, they kept it secret. I don't think they even. I don't think Hunter even knew, cause they, cause they told, they told Hunter to go to the final four. I don't even think, I don't even think they even know. I don't think Hunter even knew they would, they would go shading. 
But I mean, but that's what I'm saying, Box. What if what if he really is a boss? You know what I'm saying? Nah. What if he really did make that boss move? Box. No matter what, you got to give him some credit because he's the AD of this transaction yeah. that's happened. They got no they matter got, any way you slice it. When they say John Pelle, John Calipari was hired, he was hired by who? Hunter Yurchek. There you go. So no matter where, how much credit you give to some other party, <laughs> his name was attached to it, dog. That's it. Let me, let me ask you this: <laughs> Kansas City Chiefs got a general manager, right? They said, yeah, they do. The they, head coach they, is one who do who make all the calls. Bleacher Report got it on here now. They said somebody on Twitter just said uh, a five million dollar NIL budget is wild. Hey, Kevin mm. Garnett just made a tweet. Kevin Garnett, the basketball Hall of Famer, said Coach Cal to Arkansas, eight million a year and six million in NIL. Is that real? It's different out here, Lord. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to be talking all night. I, I think I'm about to turn on Sports Center because it's going to be a whole bunch of hog talk. Yeah, it's going to be some. They might as well just put the Woo Pig podcast on ESPN and let us cook. Yes, sir. Hey, hey man. Now, let's go. Hey, Coach Cal. Hey, holla at your boys, mate. Mine that's that's going to be the play right there. We need to get Coach Cal on the show, bro. Ooh, Do you tell know me that. This, this is hey, the second most popular Coach news Cal. story when it comes to basketball. I mean, yeah. we gonna, we might end up the women's finals done, so it's number the f- men's final in Arkansas. That's the conversation. Yeah, right. That's the ooh, hey, hey baby, we trending number Next, one. On hey, Twitter. we gonna be crunk, man. We gonna have Coach Cal on the show, man. Y'all gonna have to get y'all stuff together, man. Hey, um, hey I'm biased. I'm gonna need you to get a haircut. And I'm, <laughs> <laughs> you know, what? I'm gonna go back full wolf. And you keep messing with me. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you full get... wolf. Man, man, we're gonna have to make you get a haircut. You're gonna have to have your uh, audio together. We can't, you're not coming out here messing up Coach okay? Cal's show. My audio's fine, man. My hey, audio's man. Okay? You need you to sound crispy, man. We need you to sound crispy, man. We want you to sound crispy oh, like yeah, we do. That's the difference. I sound okay. I don't sound crispy. Yeah. You ain't crispy Prize right now. Prize yeah, man. See, you. I'm telling you, hey, man, we're going to we gonna, we gonna start being, being selective with the people we let on the show when we talking to Coach <laughs> Cal. Because, you know, hey, we're going to start say, betting, y'all. That means I got to step my game up. I gotta, what yeah. The problem for me is I'll be working at night, man. I'm going to be stuck in the chat game. <laughs> <laughs> Prize Picks just said Drake to Arkansas via the transfer portal. Oh, oh man. Well. <laughs> we don't want that clown. No, because every time he issues. bet on the, the t- other team win. Right. <laughs> Drake got other issues. He got to handle Kendrick before he come over here. That's, <laughs> mm. that's big facts. Mm. Mm. Well, at least the fans ain't got to contribute to ALL. Shout out Jimmy Flock Hooker, man. I know, right? Well, we yeah. still should contribute. Go buy more Tyson chicken. That's the word. Yeah, that's my. That's all I'm contributing. I'm chicken. That's real. Hey, I gotta get out. I'm, yeah. be, I'm, hey, I'm definitely for the games, bro. I just got I just got this text message, man, bro. They talking about, hey, man, y'all need to keep your eye on Bronny. Just wait when I watch what I'm telling you. Come on, man. Let's go, hey. bro. Hey. Hang on. Chat, send send him all back. about the eyeball. Send that text back, bro. Hey, come on, man. Hey, return the sender. Whoever sent you that, say return the sender. See, DZ see the vision. He's saying visibility matters. See that it's because amazing. I mean look I mean but look at the connection. Look where Musk goes and Bronny gets in the portal. And guess where now who takes Musselman's exit is Calipari and he loses Bronny to back to the place that he just left. That's almost like a slap in the face to Musselman. Mm. They ain't worried about yeah. it. But I don't necessarily want Drake. Bronny. We about to have Drake and LeBron on a podcast this time next year. So y'all tune in, man. It's it's about to get yeah. crazy. <laughs> Nasty. Crazy right now. We started from the bottom. Now we're here. <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, hey, I'm man, about yeah. to go take it easy, y'all. I'm glad about right, this. Bro. I'm glad that you guys are happy after being mad. You know, we're going oh, we to be good. We're going to be rocking and rolling, you know. So I look forward to... You know what's next? It's gonna be a lot of activity, and you keep yes, on sir. acting up, these Hey, hey, man! The Whoopie Podcast, man. We about to be a part of it, man. This we everybody finna eat off of this, man. I mean, Coach Cal gonna make everybody relevant because guess now how many people are going to start googling Razorback content? You got some people that are uh, Coach Cal fun or fans. So guess what? They gonna be able to see. They gonna be able to see something that they ain't never seen in any 
uh, college space is the Woo Pig Podcast. So we're going to be out here for Coach Cal, and we're going to be doing our thing. So y'all stick and stay, man. Go tell a friend to tell a friend to find us, the Woo Pig Podcast on all your major outlets. But look here, man, look us up on on YouTube, uh, and, and please like and subscribe. You're going to get this kind of content, man. We some exciting news, man. The Arkansas Razorbacks have hired Coach Cal, man, to be our, our new uh, basketball head coach. Hey, why y'all? JP said, why y'all hating on him? Hey, this is him and Coach <laughs> Cal. Why y'all hating on him? He said, he up. <laughs> he said, so y'all Let's can hate go, all you JP. want to. Wow. That's, hey, that's <laughs> yes, sir. Hey, man. Oh. Right hey, down. I boy, we definitely hey the Woo Pig Podcast plugged in. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't know. Y'all see what who we, where we at with it? The Woo Pig Podcast is plugged in. Y'all do not forget. It's gonna be some amazing stuff going on throughout the year, man. Because we're gonna bring you that insider information, baby. Man, that's facts. That's facts. Man, I got one super chat here to read. Uh, shout out my guy Matt, always supporting the channel. He said, "Man, our first game will be packed." Going to have yes, famous sir. people in Arkansas. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What's going down? Let's go. Oh, oh. Well, I'm Let's to go. Hey, we man. about to blow up. They said this is an earth shattering hire by Arkansas on Twitter. Ooh. And we out here, man. We out here. Man, <laughs> I'm going to say this, man. I appreciate, bro, everybody who's yeah. been rocking with us for the last three hours. <laughs> Oh man, it's been three, man, we had some exciting news, man. We We've really been did. Rocking for three hours, bro. Bro, this is one of our longest ones, man. We just had some exciting news, man. We just couldn't let you guys go. We uh, y'all got some live reactions, man, from the from the Ruby podcast, man, in the in the hog pen. So, man, that was awesome. We appreciate you guys being a part of that tonight. For sure, for sure, man. I appreciate everybody for kicking it with us, man. It's been fabulous. The hogs got yeah. that guy. All the Razorback yes, family got their guy. Hey, we can move on. Woo. We can stop. We can stop asking for hundred che- hundred year check to get fired. Uh, all that, all that. Up until he stopped saying he ain't gonna get a Woo Pig podcast, they press credentials, and then we call him. Oh for yeah, his head. it's going We call him for his head. But anyway, we ain't gonna talk about that right now. We gonna we gonna keep it a bean. We happy today. We got our guy. We got a we got a coach. Hey, you can be happy, you can be sad, but one thing about Hog fans, they're going to get behind whoever they hire, and we know we got top notch. Hey, we know we ain't got no St. Eyes. We got we got Wellers, as my boy the paper player said. <laughs> so, hey, but it's still going to get you baby. where you need to be, baby. Yes, sir. Hey, if you haven't done so, man, make sure you subscribe to the channel. You got to yeah. come back and kick it with us, man. We doing this here three times a week, every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday. 8.30 p.m. Central Standard Time, man. Tap in, subscribe, hit the bell icon to be notified when we about to go live. Hey, you see it right there. Make sure you subscribe. If you ain't done so already, make sure you hit the like button on your way out. I appreciate all 326 people who have hit the like button. As of right now, man, we got over 650 people in the building, man. We appreciate y'all. But, man, DZ, you got anything you want to Hold up, Mo, you got anything you want to say, baby, before we get up out of here? Man, I just appreciate what y'all are doing, bros. Man, y'all, y'all are setting the Arkansas pod. Y'all are setting the standard for Arkansas podcasting, man. The Woo Pig podcast is setting the standard, bro. I just want to take yeah. my hat off, y'all, bro. You man, know we appreciate I'm it, bro. Absolutely, man. Ain't number love, bro. But man, yeah, that's to what's up, bro. as the coach, man, that's the huge. That's that's the hugest news we've heard in a decade. A long time. Um, yes, sir. Absolutely. Y'all here to share that news with my bros, man. And y'all just stay tuned because the Woo Pig podcast is going up, bro. Uh, I appreciate it. Now, now Mo, before we get up out of here, man, tell the people where they can find you at. Yes, sir. Uh, the Hog Wild podcast, man. Um, yes, sir. Content, man. We we doing reactions, man. We we got a lot to react to now. Yeah, it's, y'all, it's, go su- y'all go support. Yeah. yeah y'all go can support go check the channel, man. Podcast, man. Um. That's where y'all can find me at, bro. If y'all want to see some reactions, if y'all want to see some film on these players, man, football, basketball, we going to have it for you, man. Live reactions to any any type of highlight film we can get our hands on, bro. It's about to go up. Facts, facts. 
But man, we appreciate you coming on and kicking it with us, man. You know it's our family. It's love over here, baby. You know, we gonna we gonna support, baby. Absolutely, now, man. DZ, talk to us, man. <sighs> man. Um, how you feeling, man? I, I how you feeling, young buck? Pig family. I can't explain it, man. When I say when it, it get worse before it get better. Think about how hopeless you were waking up this morning, reading those tweets, man. Just think about yeah. where we were as a as a family, as a Razorback family. It's 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 over. It's done. <laughs> we here. I know it's still a lot <laughs> we gotta prove, but Man, I'm shaking right now. Shout out to the 600 plus people that's been rocking with us for three hours. Shout out to these two guys next to me who created this platform to where we can even do this together as a Razorback family. Hey, we did it, Pig family. We did it. And that's all I got to say. Hey, that's what's up. Hey, G, take us out of here, baby. Hey, man, I thought you would never ask, man. It's your boy, G Holmes, in the building. Man. You guys, man, we just, man, this, I mean, it's a big day. It really is. It truly is a big day for the Razorbacks and for fans like us that like to just get on here and just, you know, share things with our families, uh, the other Razorback fans. So, man, we just appreciate, you know, everything that you guys have, have done. And it, it's just been, it was been, it's been a great day, great day to be a Razorback. But, First of all, what we guys want you to do is we want you guys to experience peace of mind with Insurance Max. These guys are your one-stop shop for home, auto, and commercial insurance, and we're talking about statewide. So don't wait. Call today for a free, no-obligation quote and secure your future with Insurance Max. It's where protection meets affordability. Now, hey, you can give Wes, Caleb, or Sandy a call and you can start to safeguard what matters to you the most. That number is 870-534-2823. Again, that's 870-534-2823. And again, you know we always showing love to the OGs of the Woo Pig Podcast. That is 3M Electric. Now, these guys are serving Northwest Arkansas, and guess what? They are your trusted contractor that then guess what they do they do both commercial and residential electrical contracting they are an sd vosb what is that that is a service disabled veteran owned small business these guys are both reliable and dependable with no job being too big or too small look when it comes to all of your electrical needs give 3m electric a call that number 479-408 Nine eight six five. Again, that number is four seven nine four zero eight nine eight six five. And when you call either one of these sponsors, you let them know that your boy's over here at the Woo Pig Podcast sent you. <laughs> hey man, they got something special for you, man. Thanks to our sponsors, man. And look here, man. Next week is, is going down. Friday night, we will be up on the hill for the spring game, the Woo Pig Podcast, and all the cast of characters, man, that you guys are you know, so uh, fond of, we hope, man. We're going to be up on the hill. We're going to be at Walk-Ins on Weddington. It's right there. The address is 1199 North Shallow Drive in Fayetteville, Arkansas, right there off of Weddington. Come by, kick it with the family, man. We're going to be there from about 630 until they close. And so come out, man. We're going to take some pictures and get some video and stuff, man, and just hang out with the, you know, with the family. You guys have been a part of something that's been, I mean, super fun for me and OD. So it's a uh, matter of fact, uh, on the 10th will actually be our one year anniversary. So it's kind of cool, man. The next week we're going to be able to kick this thing off, man. We got some great news today, but it will be our one year anniversary. And we want to celebrate with the Woo Pig podcast because we do it for you, man. And we would do it you know, to the end of time. So thank you. That's going to be this Friday up in uh, Fayetteville. Everybody come out, go tell a friend to tell a friend. It's at 11, uh, 99 North shallow on uh, right there off of Weddington. Also, uh, on the first year the first game of the year, we will be, uh, down here in little rock. We don't have a big tailgate set up. It's going to be, oh man, some, the, uh, both the sponsors will be there. We're going to be out there tailgating, man. It's going to be another good time. And that is going to be on, I think it's August the 31st. As a, a UAPB Golden Lions against the Arkansas Razorbacks. Come out there and kick it with us. And I told OD, we're going to be checking receipts. If you are not 
subscribe and supporting the Woo Pig Podcast. And you know, we're gonna check it. We're gonna have, you gonna have to pull it up on your phone. You're gonna have to show me. Hey man, you ride with us because we're gonna be cooking, man. We're gonna be, I mean, we're gonna be playing dominoes and cars and just hanging out with the family, man. It's a family atmosphere. We do it for the family and the hog fans. So uh come out, kick it with us on the first game of the year. We love to see you. But man, thanks to OD, the bad little brother, man, Coach Box. Man, we just having a good time, man. We're going to run it up now, man. Coach Cal going to be in the city. Man, the Woo Pig Podcast, we coming. But until then, you know what I like to say. I said what I said. Oh, oh, oh my God. And we out. Yeah, it's the 501, baby. Uh-huh. You know how we get down on the Woo Pig Podcast? Woo. Shout out OD. Shout out G Holmes. It's the bad. Big sexy. Do it. Woo. Yeah. Yeah.